Alrighty. Who wants to hit me with that spicy recap? I will. Oh, Previously shit. on it. the Dark Sermon. Wow. Yes. Here we go. We started with the original four being in the cafeteria, but it was time for Sunday Mass. They made their ways to the cathedral where Mythos and Charles were also, and we listened to a very rousing preach by the substitute preacher that was there. Morale was high, and everyone was excited to bask in her holy light. That's right. Once the mass was completed, the original four had a short meeting with Proctor Lanternbridge, where he explained to them that he would no longer be leading their group, and that they would be receiving new orders from a new leader. They were instructed to go to a room where Mythos and Charles were, along with Inspector or Inquisitor Trent. The group came in, introductions were made, and we were given explanation about what the Inquisition was and told that we would be doing a trial run, a quest for the Inquisition to see if we would be worthy enough to join the ranks of the Inquisition. After a few more introductions, the group was given time to get all of their items and gear in order. Once that was completed, Ariel was given a silver whistle. It was She was instructed to use that to travel to our destination and to return once it was time for our task to be completed. Upon blowing the whistle, a majestic pegasus flew down from the heavens, basking in Matheria's light. With a cart attached, the crew piled into the cart, and off the Pegasus flew. Quite the bumpy ride, but eventually the Pegasus very quickly and deftly got us to our destination in the Silent Faces Mountains. Upon landing, we got out of the cart, and we began doing some scouting around the area to figure out where we would like to go. We had the options of going high into the mountains, going into the caves, or going down to the lower plateaus. After some attempts at climbing with a crab summon, that didn't go too well. And exploring more on the level we were at, Mikael noticed a rope that led down to the bottom, near where some forest and shrubbery were. The crew climbed down and began making an, uh, survival checks to scout out the area, and they came across what seemed to be a village of sorts in the middle of the mountains, one that is unrecorded and unknown. And that was where we left off with our group planning how they would handle this new situation. Well done. Inspiration for you. Okay. Hey. So, I got one thing I got to talk above table about. Um, reviewing the content that's coming up. I, uh, I wanted to make sure that I wasn't hitting anybody's triggers. So, mm -hmm. as this is a village, and you're supposed to kill everything... There are going to be some targets you may not feel comfortable doing that to. Uh, mm -hmm. What I'm speaking of are the children involved. Uh, yes. So, if that's the case, if anybody here, you could send me a DM, so you don't have to, like, be embarrassed or anything. Just send me a DM, because I think it was one of you. I can't remember which one in your interview said that. And if that's the case, then I'll have to do um, some finagling. So, take Take it at this time to send me a DM if that's a problem for you. Uh, also, treat this as a trigger warning to anybody who's watching right now or who is about to be watching the VODs in the future that um, obviously, you know, warning and all of that because um, they are the Inquisition and there is some dark things afoot. We're going to touch on some pretty dark topics, most likely. Things such as, you know, torture and... It, yeah. So, yeah. if you are fate of heart and do not wish to participate in that, then you have been warned. And if there's any party member here that has a problem with any of that dark stuff, you let me know now uh, so that I can make the adjustments needed. <clears throat> Alright, give me a second. Do -do 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 Hold on. Uh, 
I've told him to get some DMs, I'm responding to them. In just a moment. <clears throat> mm-hmm, mm-hmm. It's good enough. Just doing my job. So we are basically being put into a no-Russian situation. Well, it's... It, look, you guys are the Inquisition, and all that means, and you were given very explicit orders, so I'm just making sure that before we go forward that nobody is put in an unfairly uncomfortable place, and if I know ahead of time, um, mm-hmm. then I can make adjustments to lower that discomfort level. That's all. And, and we appreciate that. You mm. appreciating me? Mm-mm. There'll be none of that. Nobody expects the Mactharian Inquisition. <laughs> no one expects the but <laughs> Damn it. You took it from me. Look, man. Thank you, thank you. Sometimes we can also just... be the Spanish Inquisition. Ah, no. Macuetos es, uh, the... <laughs> Los oh, Cuetas no. says, I'm going to kill you, but <laughs> no, battery. No, mi hero, mi hijo. No. <laughs> mi hijo. Yes. Yes, I will. put it in notes. <laughs> okay. And checking messages, making adjustments. They talk to me and be like, ni me no comprende. <laughs> and just cut their heads off. Uh, I don't okay. have too much problem killing children. If they give me, especially if they give me back access, but out of character, I'll still feel like an asshole for doing it. But oh man, listen. Well, this, this this is me talking to the players. I just want to make sure everybody's yeah, yeah, yeah. comfortable before we go forward because there is obviously the possibility that you know we could hit some dark shit. That's all. Yeah. Yep. 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 Mm-hmm. I'm just. Let being... me engulf myself in it. Yeah. You know. Nah, man. Let no. let me murder everyone. No. I've been no. waiting for this day. This would be in fucking. Mm-hmm. Yes. Cognizant. Has been. All right. Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. What the f- Oh, God. Ugh. You alright? I'm alright. Ugh. Gross. Alright, let me load this thing up and make sure that it's not horribly and improperly sized. It seems like things are properly sized. Uh, this is your entry point. Oh. There's one thing I can do. Let's make this not look like garbage. Let's do a little, a little wham. There we go. Okay, is this properly sized? It is. Yes. Okay, good. I don't know how big is the bread on that map. <laughs> how big is the bread? Massive. <laughs> <laughs> what is this? A, what is this bread for giants? Nice. All right, let me Finally find you. Finally, enough carbohydrates. Let me find you guys. Uh oh, I'm having some lag issues. Uh oh. There we go. Weird. Okay, that looks proper. Your token looks good. 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 All right, good. We are ready, steady, Freddy. Okay. Uh, you are approaching during the day, but from a heavily covered position, so I will lift the fog of the map since you can see it from where you're standing. Uh, let me do that real quick over here. Configure, lighting. So this... You had mentioned that this was a chasm, so is this like a... I'll explain. Like... I'll explain okay. in a moment. Hold on, let me just... Right. Just making sure everything's right before I show it to you guys. Yeah, 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 you're good. Thank you very much. Um, at the moment, I'm currently having issues with Foundry, and I am incapable of loading um, the stuff, just, what, just as a heads up. Loading, what screen are you at? Loading what? Gray. It, it keeps perpetually staying on gray. It might just be slow. It, it uh, might just be slow. Yeah, I, have to I figured that minute. might be it, but it's already been five minutes. That's why I figured I'd but say something. But you're all stealing each other's bandwidth. Oh, no, she's at a hotel. No, I'm at the hotel. I will. You guys hear that? Yes. Yes. All right, here we go. Loading you guys in. Here we go. Yeah.
All right. Those of you that are able to load, are you loaded in? Yep. Yes. Okay. Can somebody stream for Void? I am currently. Okay. It's okay. I got my cell phone up. Nice. Swag. Because if the laptop don't work, the cell phone does. <laughs> Oh, do I, do I still need to stream or? or no, you don't any... need to stream, dear. I got it. Oh, yeah. All right, cool, cool. Tight, 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 tight. Mm -hmm. Is everybody else good? <coughs> all right. You good? Hi, my lord. All righty, here we go. So, first things first, give me perception checks right off the bat. Do I, I also roll? these. Fuck. Could no. you roll for me? Pretty please? Okay, not bad. Do you need me to do it? I can roll for you. Yeah, because uh, this is not rolling. So uh, yeah, I think this is how we're doomed today. 15. All right. Today, no, we're total out. Cool, cool. Thank you. All right, I'm going to zoom out a little bit, representing your ability mm -hmm. to see. So. First thing that you notice is there are a series of small, small, it's a village. There's a series of buildings at the bottom. Uh, you are currently, to kind of give you an idea, you are about 200 feet above them, right? So these craggy walls represent the, the hills on the side of the mountain, or excuse me, the cliffs on the side of the mountain. And these trees are all kind of growing up on the hillside. Have you guys ever seen that before? Like fucking tree cliffs? Like yeah, trees yeah. on cliffs? yeah. 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 That's kind of what you're at. So you're up in the cover up here. And so this goes up into the mountain range. And it's approximately 60... Uh, hold on, I'm lagging. Uh, it's about 60 feet or so. Uh, and this is a 100-foot drop here. And this is a 100-foot drop here. Jeez. Yep. And that's kind of what you see up ahead. Right now it's during the day. You can see that there are some people working off in the distance and other things of that nature. People are moving about the village. So, let me know what you would like to do. Um, so, when we were descending, or and we or like right before we descended, when we were coming down, like, is this like a oasis forest, like within like a mountain chasm? Or does it like go off out into like the... It, it is it is all self-contained inside of the mountain range. This is a valley in the mountain range. Mm -hmm. That's why it's so mm -hmm. hidden. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Uh, nobody uh, is opposed to it. Mythos would like to kind of peek and, and look for anything that seems like arcane in nature. Are there any, like, sigils or any carvings or anything that seems magical about anything in this area from your, do that. Mm -hmm. from your current stance you don't really see anything like that but you are also okay. like 300 feet away like you're pretty far away and under heavy cover okay you can only really see what i've shown you like the buildings and some people in the distance but nobody can see you because you're in the cover right now but mm -hmm. you don't you don't see anything obvious like yeah. a circle for example mm. do any of uh, these people well, I, they'd probably still be too far away. I was going to ask if they have any markings of druids or anything. You're way too far from we that. Were, yeah, we were told to look out for druids. So. Mm. Uh, Captain Ward. Yes, sir. Uh, I feel like we should destroy this rope to make it harder to escape when we do start attacking. Mm-hmm. I agree. And if you spot any others... We should get rid of those as well. And mm -hmm. we don't have our recon squad, so we might want to... Pace um, ourselves and take our times. Think on a direct approach. You said pace, right? Not piss. Pace. Yes. Okay. Yes. Sorry. <laughs> my, my brain said we should piss ourselves. I'm like, what? No. <laughs> no, we piss on them. We will piss on them. Oh, oh, oh. We will pee on them after we kill them. Yes. That's a we do it off the side. And I'm, they sorry, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to distract. Rain. I just it threw me into the next area. Like it threw me into the stratosphere. I thought she said we piss ourselves. Dude. I was like, whoa. Oh, buddy. 
Whoa. <laughs> okay, well, if that's the case, I will destroy the rope behind us so nobody can use it. Do any of you see any others? Well, we might need to wa walk might along need to the... walk along the edge. Yeah. All right, we'll want to be lightly spaced out, but I think we should all stick together since we're not splitting into any recon squads. Mm -hmm. Given the heavy armor and lack of our stealthy nature, we just get to be in this together. Are, are, any, are you two new guys good at stealthing? You're being sneaky? I wouldn't say I'm good at it, but I'm not particularly bad. Uh, I can do some of it, uh, not my specialty, but I did have um, situations where I had to get out of crowds in a not conspicuous way. See, I can be nothing. My skin color is the same as the tree. Speak a little closer to the mic there, Merciless. Uh -huh. I said I can be stealthy. My skin color is the same as the trees. No, your yes. armor is not. Your armor is not. Yes, it is. Your enthusiasm is Got him. endearing. Baps him on but the nose. Stick with your partners. Thor with Mythos. Mikael with Charles. Gideon with me. Give yourself plenty of room. Take your time. And for love of God, do not draw attention unless Mithari. absolutely necessary. Mithari. Love of Mithari. By the love of Mithario. There you go. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's also like Mithari. keep an eye out along the edge to see if we see any more exit ropes as we scout about. Up along. I'm afraid you're going to have to move me, kid. My apologies. I'll be following This is just not wanting to load. Very well. Mm -hmm. All right, do you want me to give uh, somebody permission to move you? Yeah, just give, yeah. Her, give her to me. All right, let me hold on. Let me switch ownerships. Hey, hey, uh, Mikael, can you check for tracks? See if anybody like has patrolling the area or, or stuff. Well, yes, of course. All right, she should have. She should have it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got you. Okay. <clears throat> so. The party is approaching up to the edge of the cover, overlooking down into the ravine and where the village is found. What do you guys want to do? I want to check for tracks to see who's been around here. Survival check. Mythos is looking for extra for, uh, exit ropes along this cliffside that we came down just in case there's check. more than one. Man, fuck. You don't see any tracks. Mythos, you do not spot any more ropes. Been so long since anybody been through here? Hmm. I don't see any tracks of people being around the area. Okay. And I haven't found any more exit ropes. Mm -hmm. And don't see anything of significance at the moment. Maybe if we keep going. Any druids, druidic marks? We're here for the circle or like Mornhal banners. Uh, Arcadum with the six, do I see any in druidic symbols? No. Too okay. far. No, I do not see any druidic symbols of the people are here to call from the earth. I think we're too far away. We need to get closer first. Mm hmm. Yes. Hmm. Was, did anyone happen to see if there's a, another way down that isn't so... They'll point to the 100-foot drop and the second 100-foot drop. <laughs> Something so steep. Uh, let me let me see if I can spot a path real quick. Hold on. No. <laughs> Man, my rolls today. Can... Uh, can I use a, like a survival check to maybe look at the rocks, which is probably the easiest path to get down here to the hundred foot sure. drop below? Sure. Okay. Also, when Gideon destroyed the rope, did he like pull it down or did he just like cut it? 
Uh, cut it. Okay, because I was gonna say, do we have a pit in and rope? Fuck, bro, a six and a seven. You don't. <laughs> Does the party have a climbing kit? I I do not. No. I do not. Uh oh. Mm -hmm. We have my crab. We're good. Did you de-summon him? Yep. Uh, no, I just told him to wait. I don't think I de-summoned him. But we'd have to wait for him to get to us. And it, it, I was gonna it was... say, why'd you ask him to wait? And is he gonna be able to hear you? He knows me. He will come if called. <laughs> Don't you think that won't... Oh yeah, so weren't you gonna try and shove him in the entrance to the cave before we got distracted by the rope? And have yes. him block the entrance? <laughs> yes, so he is waiting for us at the top of the rope. I told him he could not come down with us. I only... But How will you tell him that he can come down with us? You guys are talking right over, Reavy. Go ahead, Reavy. Mm -hmm. Sorry. Sorry. I only have 50 feet of rope and... Well, a rolling entrance with Crabopolis is something we haven't identified what sort of village do, do any of you know enough to know if this is a village on a map possibly all right who's got survival training? No history who's got survival myself training? just right. me Go, uh well you did not yeah. see it on the map the inquisitor when you were informed of it suspected it was around here but that's part of your job is to find it uh, and remember that amongst the several sub-objectives that you have that finding this place was one of them. Now that you found it, you need to decide what methods you're going to do in order to enact Metheria's justice. The Inquisitor said that this village would be in this area. So this looks seems to be like the village we need to... <clears throat> What's the easiest way to put this? Wipe off the planet. So, how do we do that will be decided as a group. We can always set fires, burn everything aflame, and then kill them as they're running out of their homes. Or, we slowly crumb through down the mountain and sneakily enter the homes and kill them while everybody's busy. And wait for maybe the older working men to come back into the village and kill them upon their arrival. We have the subtlety of a herd of spooked horses. Let's work to our strengths. I think the biggest problem right now is just trying to get down. Get down in the Regardless of whether we burn it or try and a more stealthy approach. Mm -hmm. um, I don't really see a path right now. Likewise. Ne neither do I. We can always use my crab to get down. It won't take too long to go down 100 feet. How um, many people can your crab take, and getting your crab back up for second wave of people? Um, Arcadum, how I many have... people can Crabopolis carry at once? Three. Three? How mm -hmm. long would it take me to go down 100 feet? You mean 200 feet? Is how long to go 200 back? feet, yeah. yeah. So, um, it, it's... So, Ariel, give me a martial check. Oh, I, I got you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, Holy shit. Okay. Hey. With a 26. You need to think about this tactically. If you ride a giant crab down the side of the mountain without using cover, which he can't use, you will be mm -hmm. spotted. Mm -hmm. And since you're wearing the colors of the church, your intent will be pretty clear. So, do you get what I'm saying? It, it might be best if we just wait and watch until it gets dark and then we make our descent on the crab so we don't get spotted. That is an reasonable. idea. Does anybody else have any ideas how to get down 200 feet? Um, uh, we could continue I, scouting. I, I, I will give you. I will give you one check. Why not watch and see what the villagers do? Maybe they have a way to go up and down. 
Mm. We, well, that okay. will also help us well. isolate. Mm -hmm. Okay. We're going to try and hide and be quiet. All right, roll me stealth checks. Oh fuck! I rolled my disadvantage, right? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I don't roll in with disadvantage since I'm only in medium armor. Medium correct? is also disadvantage. Medium is also disadvantage. Let's go, baby. With disadvantage? Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> I need to refresh shadowing. my computer. Jesus lord. <laughs> Holy crap. Da -da -da -da. Do we trip what the fuck over each cold? other? Is that what happened? Mythos gets on his belly and looks, looks down the scope of his heavy crossbow and just watches from the trees up in here. <laughs> Wait, why did... Why do I suddenly heal, uh, name we come on, this do not Man, I'm tied for the highest stealth check. Oh, the oh, green skin really good. does help. Oh, Corvanus, do not delete. Got an eight. Yeah, who is Corvanus, do not delete? <laughs> yeah, I don't know who's rolling that. Who the fuck is that? <laughs> this Charles. I don't think the like the the token name property was updated from when it was made. No, oh, I, see. My I, see. I see. I see. Hold on. Let me fix that. I will fix it. I fixed it already. Go ahead. <laughs> my <Lame>. my god. <laughs> so uh, hey, at least we're three hundred feet away from them when y'all rolled like trash. Hey man, listen. <laughs> I got a minus one at Dex and still rode hot with this advantage, alright? Yeah, you tied me. <laughs> That's actually really good. Alright. So as you um try to stealth The party decides to wait it out and see what happens. Make me perception checks. That was awkward. Yay, they can see. Another fucking six, man. Jesus. Alright. Alright, now, insight checks. Does, any, in. does anybody happen to have insight as a train skill? Oh my no. god. Uh, I do not and... I don't Ariel think I do. Alright. No. Yeah. Nope. Alright, I'm gonna zoom things out so I can show you over the passes of time what you observe. Sound good? Yep. Sounds Copy. good. Alright. <laughs> this looks like a good spot here. Oh, also, I had one of our newish artists, someone who's been in the round before, but I've only used them sparingly, do a whole new set for this particular village. A whole new set of NPCs. So, big shout out to Cambino, oh. specifically. <gasps> Yay! Hey! Awesome! All right. Nice. Thru throughout you watching, you see from the north here, coming down a sort of carving steps out of the side you see this man start walking through the village he seems to carry with him an air of authority a friendly smiling bushy beard and a small bird that seems to sit atop his bald head as he walks throughout the village the people seem to look at him with respect and he returns that respect with joy your insight tells you that that man might be the village elder Whilst observing, the village elder is approached by a fairly large man and another smaller lad, younger, who seems to be following him around like a mentor or father, and they seem to exchange a few words. And you see this guy. And following behind him, you see this young lad. Oh, 
Aww. They exchange <laughs> Bless, a few They exchange a few words and seem to continue their walks around the village. At one point, one of the houses will open and you will see a very well-dressed man walk out of it. You see this guy. It seems he talks to almost no one, goes about his business, and then rapidly returns home. He looks a bit skittish. You also see this man almost walk right on top of you as he climbs down the side of the mountain. He carries on his back a slaughtered deer and he goes down a set of stone steps that are etched into the side of the mountain from that position. He walks up to this orchard, picks an apple, and munches on it as he continues on his way. At this point, the sun begins to, begins to dip low. I need new perception checks as night settles in. Oh, so Man. many ones today. You guys are, you guys are just rolling awful. I... We got an eighteen and a sixteen. That's not terrible. I mean, like overall. Yeah, yeah. yeah overall, overall, it's I, been I, shit. Yeah, I, yeah, yeah. I, it's, it's mostly been me though. I blame this keyboard of radios. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. How well does Radio normally roll in his games? Is he the good uh, roller or the bad roller? I, I, I don't know. It's incompatible Juju, don't worry. It, it, it really is. I, 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 my hands are as far away from this thing as I can possibly be. <laughs> <laughs> like, it, it makes me very uncomfortable. Alright. It feels like it's getting a bit colder. That's been, I don't know, hours. You guys see anything yet? Uh, yes, I happen to see a man he came from behind us up the mountain. It seems there's a path farther to the north that allowed him to get down into the valley. All right. Are we all ready to do what we must? <laughs> Are we ready to set out, Miss Ariel? Uh, do we want to continue reconnaissance? No. I think we've done enough of that. Um, um, one of my concerns is if we start burning too quickly, we lose access to information. This right. is true. Mm -hmm. We can go start by going house by house and killing people. We uh, seems like we could take mm -hmm. the village elder. He could probably know the most out of everybody there. Did we he see could... where he went? Uh, Mercatum, did any of us see where he went? Where who went? To the northwest. The village elder. Yeah, elder. The village elder went somewhere to the northeast. Okay. okay. All right. We'll um, head that way. Well, why not walk our way to him through all the houses? Chances for escape are going to be a concern. Yes, it is. Mm. But it's Plus not like we, we can fireball around the mob either. Plus, we might lose them in the dark. Mm -hmm. So, are, are we, we going for... a diplomatic opener? <laughs> no. I, Wait, depending on who have... they are, I don't think that would work very well. If these should are we have... the druids we're seeking, then... Go ahead, Mr. Mm. Gideon. I was gonna suggest maybe we should have two people stay behind at these steps. So nobody can escape, at least not from this way. Because so I don't All think right. we saw any other way access. To in or out, yeah. All right. I could do that. Be a good match for that. Oh. All right. I will, uh, or I will cover your back. 
You just keep me informed of what you see, Mythos. Okay. But also, we should keep an eye out to see if there's any more of these stairways or crawling paths, just in case, as we make our way up. I can show you where he went down at. Uh, 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 Mythos, she she can't. She's blind. No, I'm, I was I was talking to all of you. Oh. Well, yeah. Gotcha. He'll start leading the way up to where he saw the man go down. And then we'll keep an eye out along the edges just in case there's other little handholdy spots or stairs. Okay. Can any of you see in the dark? No. Uh, I can because I came prepared and cue the uh, freaking music of uh, Popeye the Sailor Man. When he drinks his spinach. Okay. And I'll drink we a potion of dark vision. Towards the front. All right, potion of dark vision. Is then you and Ariel need to go forward. All right. Okay, so Gideon's going to be taking point, and then that way we could try to minimize risk as we go towards the stairs. Is that the plan? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Copy. Let's go. All right. Okay. The party starts to wake their way down the stairs. Until finally, they walk down about 200 feet worth of these stone steps, and they find themselves just outside one of the villagers' homes. Do you see any windows or lights in that building south of us? Perception. Mythos. With those perception checks, you can see that there is a single light, a candle burning through the window that you can kind of see a slit through here. It doesn't uh, need to be a candle lit. Mm -hmm. There's going to be somebody inside the home. Mm -hmm. The more of the songs we walk away from, the more chance it is we will be spotted. I think it's best we go home by home and kill them as we go. That, that's going to be noisy. We want to start with the village elder, which you said was to some northeast. Do you see where he might have gone? He was somewhere northeast, I don't know where. But the more of these houses we walk by, you we don't want to be caught in the middle of the village and yeah, everyone so be start, alive and attack us. Start That's true. Core. Ethos will prop himself up a little bit on the stairway just to get a little bit of elevation and we'll go prone again and pull out his crossbow. Like because we start can... here and someone screams, Mikael? Mm-hmm. Then you may lose your chance to serve Metheria properly. So start with the core objective. The objective is to kill everyone. You also need to deal to get with the Druid info. Circle. Do you know where the Druid Circle is, Mikael? No. We need the person who knows things. Fair enough. Hey, Thorn, can you hand me one of those collars that we got, just in case? I. I also have shackles. Not that I would need them for very long anyway. Um, I believe Ariel has um, a way to sense magic. I don't know if it's going to do us any good here, but I, it's just a thought. Uh, to try to isolate and try to find the circle. Once things go hot, I can activate the pendant and see where magic is from, but activating it right now... I like that idea a bit better, yeah. Yeah, and you do have divine sense, but it's only 60 feet. Yeah. Well, if you... if the four of you lead on and try to... get the head... when things go loud... we're over here... I'll activate and see what we can find. 
Okay. So or me if those can tell me when our uh, cover is blown. Okay. Arcade with the uh, with the perception checks. Is there anybody outside of the village, like by this campfire, on the logs or anything? Anybody outside walking around? You see what you see. Okay. I right. get in since you have the dark vision. How about you lead us? Uh, yeah, I could do that. Uh, so I guess we'll then, go not see the village. Thorn, you're staying here by the stairs, yeah? Yes. With Mythos, yes. All right. We'll try cool. to make sure that anyone help? that tries to run gets mm-hmm. stopped. And if things get too hairy, just give us a sign and we can come rush to your aid. Uh, yeah, you do the same. Thank you. Best of luck. And uh, if I can try and... Is there some place like here or here I can possibly hide? Yeah, there's trees there. Yeah. Yeah, sure. I said no as far as shrubbery to try and help with the stealth check as much as that can. Alright, well. Go for it. Uh, I guess we'll stealth our way towards. Uh. <laughs> oh my god. My I'm god. I'm very much under the impression Sweet that it's. Jesus. Walk over. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Yo, yo, we don't, we don't, we don't stealth. You, you four just walk over there. You are the Inquisition. Please go. Yeah. <laughs> Trying to stealth, Whoa, but all you hear is chink, 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 chink. chink. That was a, that's a don't bad worry, we're, they won't hear us coming. <laughs> <laughs> what? Oh my god, we're gonna get caught in the middle of this village. <laughs> all right, so. Me staying still and stealthing was not the signal for you to try to stealth. Y'all right. just walk. Who's walking up? These four? Yes, yeah. us four. Yeah. We're going towards the north, the northeast where we saw the uh, elder All right, heading you towards. Just, you're just walking this way. Yeah. All right. I will be okay. trying and not walk into the light. If they get too far away. And I'll keep an I'll keep an eye out what for. I... Uh... All right. When you get to about here, you can hear. Um, Somebody kind of singing to themselves softly in this in this house. Mm-hmm. Unfortunately, you kind of snap a twig as you walk by, and you'll hear someone call out, "Someone there!" Uh, yeah, uh, just came across the village. We were just wondering what was going on. Uh, we kind of got lost in the mountains. Lost Arcana, in the mountains. Where's the door to this building? Uh, the door is... Hold on, it's dark even for me. Hold on, hold on, look here. Oh, here. Mm-hmm. Right there. Okay. okay. I'm gonna that take... Also a door? Yeah, there's two there's doors. Door. There's two okay. doors. I'm gonna take a step and draw my sword and step by this door. As soon as this guy walks outside this door, I'm chopping his fucking head off. Alright. This door will open. It looks like... Or maybe I can help you find your way back, right friends! Now. And all right, I'm gonna fucking remove this guy's head from his body. Okay. Well, make your attack at disadvantage. Or advantage, not disadvantage. Sorry. Yep, to my. Okay. Can't quite make out what they're doing over there. All right, you will cut into the man's fucking chest. All righty, it's combat time. Oh, that guy's got a lot of fucking health. Let's do this, boys. <laughs> oh no. He's Did got more health than a glass that? merchant. <laughs> oh, oh no. Oh my god. <sighs> oh my god. Of course I go last in initiative. Oh, All man, right, it had so to be the beefy guy. So obviously, you guys have a surprise round. Mhm. So force him back inside the house. Here we go.
Yes. Mm. Go ahead, pass. You're up first, Charles. Yep. Yeah. Yep. I will be walking up. And I'll like to try and shove him inside the house. Okay, athletics check. And to speak. I will defend it with acrobatics. Okay. Damn it. Wait, is Charles hurt? He shouldn't be. No, what? Why are you damaged, no, Charles? He's missing okay. health and no AR. So, Charles is hurt because he fell. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. Did you guys not heal? What about his armor and stuff? No. There no. wasn't anything done at the end of session. We kind of wrapped up with that, and then we started here. So, there we are. Ding, ding, Charles. He's got his armor and stuff back, though. Yeah, mm -hmm. I, I, I gave him his armor and shield back. Yeah. No, yeah, that's what concerned me, is he had no armor and was missing health. I'm like, whoa! <laughs> All right, that it for you? Um, Void, I thought you healed him at the end of session. You laid on hands him after he fell. Yeah. Look, man, it's your responsibility to heal your character, so why are you damaged? <laughs> like, did you just not heal, or what are you doing here? I did not uh, finish off healing. Okay. I like taking chances and save my spell slots. As you wish. Anything else? Movement? Bonus action? No, oh, I'm gonna end my turn here. Ariel. Um, I don't think I have much placement to move to try to get the individual shoved in. I mean, you can stand right here and do it. I, I need you to show me where, because I can't see. Right here. If you stand um, right here, you can still have the, the side to shove him back in. Okay. If you want um, to. I guess I'll, I'll do that. And do you have enough movement to go to the other side if necessary? Uh, yeah. Okay, then let's do it that way then. He can also scream. You can also cover his mouth and charge him in. That would be preferable, yes. Okay, so... You want to move here and then athletics check to cover his mouth? And force him back in the house. So, that's a grapple check. So, roll okay. that. Roll athletics. You strong, girl. You strong, girl, yes. Hell yeah. Fucking beat this man's ass. Mm, right. oh. You successfully grapple him. Yep. That does and... not cover his mouth, but you grapple him. Yep. Okay. And we'll, as grappled, pull him back into the house. Yes. How much so, movement does she have left? Uh, That was 15, so she has 15 feet left. It's half speed when dragging or pushing someone. So, so she yeah, can she move can... him five feet back. Yeah. Which will get him inside the house, I think. Yeah. That it for you? Um, I believe so. Yeah. Surprised. Mikhail. All right. Um, him being grappled, do I have an advantage on attacks? No. No? Okay. He's got to be restrained for that. And there's no way for me to get inside the building now with him, with her standing there. There's the other door here. Yeah, you can go through the other door. How far is that for... That's 10 feet to me. Was it 15 feet to the door? Yep. Okay, so I'll, I'll go to the door. Just don't block me. Um... So I'll do for my, uh, yeah, I'll go to the door. Um, bonus action, uh, divine favor. Okay. I'm gonna do that real quick. I 
if I wanted to drop my sword and pick up my uh, heavy crossbow, is that an action? So it's a free it's a free action to drop your weapon. I am interaction to pull out your crossbow and then action to fire. Okay, so that's what I'll do. So first, let me do. Uh, I'll do one thing at a time here. Did it roll it? Oh, there it goes. Okay. And then I will shoot him with coward's chance. That'll hit. Okay. Nine plus a one D four. No, it's a one D four. And then another D four of radiant. Okay. And that will be my turn. Uh, so that's. 15. I took a step in the door, my bad. Because that was my 30 feet, so. Yeah. All right. Uh, then I'll move the 15 to here. Oh, martial checks. We keep forgetting to do that martial check. Yeah, yeah, I got you. And I'll get right here. Um, and then I'll go ahead and martial check him. What would you like to know uh, about Ranger Lloyd? Uh, what are his special abilities, if any? His special abilities are Hunter's Instinct, Primeval Awareness, Grit. And the following. Uh, what is his martial feat? Uh, let's see here. His martial feat is... Weapon Adept. Aha! Alright, um... With the bow. Longbow. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Um... Am I able to aid in her grapple so she can no. get him down? Okay. No. I didn't think you so. You cannot do that. All right. Just making sure. As per always, the rules for a complete overwhelm in that regard has to be done by the same grappler. That's three yeah. successes with no failures or interruptions. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. All right. Uh, then I will just item interaction uh, equipped my sword. The Burning Wrath. And I shall attack. Hit. Damage. It's damage. 20 damage. And then that will be all for me. Charles, I think. By my various lights, you shall be silenced. Oh! Okay, silence. Ariel? Oh, sorry. Are you done? Is there anything else you want to do, Charles? No, nope. I'm just gonna stand there and hold, hold concentration for it while they. Uh... Okay. Ariel. 
Uh, I would like to continue the grapple and force him in. Okay, you can move right. him in. You can make an additional athletics check to knock him prone, if you'd like. I think that would be for the best. Okay. All right. Mm. Not today. Ah. Alright. On his turn, he will attempt to shout, and nothing will come out. He will... God, that's clutch. He will attempt to break free. You will do so. Uh, damn. Just barely. And he will run. Provoking. I will strike out. I would also want to strike out. Uh, that That'll missed. miss. Um... Uh, don't think we called you out having any equip. Well, I know you wouldn't have your shield equipped, so I'm gonna have to. Well, no, you would. You would come in with your shield equipped, so you wouldn't be able to grapple with your weapon. Hmm. So I don't think you have a weapon in hand to attack with. Correct. Yeah. Okay. All right, I'm going to jump to the window, breaking it. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. All righty then. Jumping to the window makes no sound. When he gets to here, however, he will start to cry out. Go. Someone screamed, Miss Thorne. Something's happening down All there. All right. Let's get going. All right, I'll I'll roll you guys in in a second. Thank you. Go ahead, Mikhail. You're muted. Oh. Okay. My apologies. All right. Hey, uh, I see this guy. How far is the drop? Arcadum. What drop? No, to the, the is, the, is there like a drop from the window? Or is it just no. quite literally it's, just? It's ground. It's ground level. He just jumped through a window. Okay. Well, I'm gonna five, ten, fifteen, twenty, twenty-five, thirty. Well, I can't go anywhere but here. All right, I'm gonna shoot him in the fucking head with the bow. Take your best shot. That'll miss. Oh, God dang, bro. It's fucking unfortunate. You hate to see it. Um. Yeah, that's that's it for my turn. Uh, I could try. To, oh, I can marshal check him. I lied. Go ahead. Go ahead. Yeah, I'm rolling it right now. What would you like to know? Mm. What are his stats? His attributes are as follows. His strength is 14. His dexterity is 18, in which he is proficient. His constitution is 14, in which he is proficient. His intelligence is 10. His wisdom is 14, in which he is proficient. And his charisma is 10. Okay. Uh, that's all I can do. All right. Uh, I will, for the time being, quietly ninja run out the window that he made. That's pretty quiet. And then come down here five. Surprise, motherfucker! <laughs> <laughs> Go ahead. Uh, ah. And I, I will non-lethal for the time being. That'll hit. 25. 
All right, he will go down. Okay, and go out. If that brings us out of combat, uh, no. Well, no. Okay. Well then. Are you done? Uh. Instead of a martial check, I am going to do a perception check to see if I can see or hear anybody approaching. Go ahead. All right, hold that thought. All, All right, right, holding. You two lying in wait. Make one set of movement towards the encounter. Are you sure that you're moving in, or...? I guess if you wanted to try and come to here, but... Um... Well, first... I stand up. So... That's, don't worry about that, you get to move towards the encounter. Okay. You were lying in wait. Okay. All right. Not a Ooh. double move, single move. Not a double, single? Okay. He'll run up next to Thorn where she was then. Okay. Uh, they're in one of the buildings to the east, straight east of where we're at. All right. Whisper to her. All right. And um, am I able to perceive anything inside? Well, hold on, let me roll you. Oh, sorry. Okay, and then I have to roll a bunch of other shit because he was able to yell. Mm hmm. Please be deep sleepers. Please be deep sleepers. Them? Yes. Right. We'll bring Metheria's wrath upon these heretics. Okay, the I'll first one. Me. No. Second one. No. Next one. No. No. And final one. All right, roll you guys up. Make perception checks if you want for this particular building. Uh, you can hear someone lightly snoring inside. All right, Gideon, that ends that. Charles. I will like to break concentration. It is a concentration spell, isn't it? No, it is not. I would like to walk over to the guy we just knocked out. I would like to cast Spare the Dying on him so he doesn't die just yet. All right. Uh, he was already stable. You don't need to do that. He was knocked out. He was non-lethal. Oh, okay. I <laughs> the, the way it was described didn't sound non-lethal, but fair enough. You must As I walk it. over to make sure to check on my hand, I'd like to signal to um to uh, to Ariel to. T Shut the light. Because I cannot speak in the zone. Uh, they can't hear anything that you're saying to them. No, that I know that. I would like, has, before I walk over to check on him, I like to hand signaling to point at the light and do a blowing sound to Ariel. Cool. Ariel, make an insight roll so you know what the hell he's talking about. Yes, I'm here. Sorry, microphone got muted. Uh, da, 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 da. And that was an insight. It 
Is Charles making a pass at you? Weird. Is is Void there? Uh, she's, she's muted. muted. Current. They're they're taking the silence RP very seriously. Yes. <laughs> Her and Mikael. I guess she's look at Charles and shrug. I guess she's not there. All right. Anyway, what are you doing, Charles? I will prepare in case someone comes any closer. I might want to do something, but right now I'm just going to take a reaction to attack uh, if any hostiles intervenes. You got it. Thorn. All right, I'll... They haven't woken up yet, Mithos. Correct, I can hear them. If you... If you you want to deal with them now? now? Mm, just the two of us? Not quite yet, if we can avoid it. We should move with them if you can, um... If you can just give them a thumbs up. We're still good. And, uh, just moving half speed. Unless there's... Or... Do you want to deal with them now? I don't know if our cover... Or is our cover blown? Well, I heard a scream. I'm not very familiar with the crew just yet, so I'm not sure if it was one of them or someone else. I saw some shadows near one of the houses for a brief moment, but they disappeared. All right. Let me know as soon as you see, um... Or let me know as soon as you see movements in the other houses. And well. I would like to move forward at half speed to do what little I can for stealth and ready to activate the pendant should Mythos say our cover is blown and that will be all for me I have nothing to marshal check Ariel I thought I had command prepped but I did not That sucks. Um, let's see here. I suppose I could try to, to approach them outside to see what's going on. That seems like a reasonable thing because I can't make out what's going on. And Charles was making weird hand signals, so I'll go investigate and approach Charles. Let me get you out of the out of the circle. All right. Yep. Go. All right. You are out of out of said circle. What did you want? I wanted you to turn off the lights. Who? Oh. Why didn't you just sit in that teasing? Go inside and I'll try to turn off the light if it's within reach. Uh, that was twenty-five to get there. So, you would need like to action item interaction if it's if like a get... candle. So, you'd move here, right? Mm -hmm. It is five feet remaining, and mm -hmm. then you'd have to dash and then item interaction to snuff out the light. Okay, mm -hmm. Let's see, no reason why right. I shouldn't. So, let's right. do it. All right, okay. Ariel and Mikael, it is now dark, you cannot see, and you cannot hear. <laughs> Good times. Oh, God. All right. I'm knocked the fuck out. Mm-hmm. Mikael. He's gonna follow a path and join his friends. 
I, right. I don't know. I don't know. I'm, he's whispering to his um, two people in front of him, Gideon and Bass. I don't know. Or Charles, my bad. I don't know why she ran in and ran back out just to turn off the light. But it's, okay, whatever she wants to do. Uh, is he dead? Mikael, do you have dark vision? No. Oh, that explains why you stepped on the riverbank. Please make me a dexterity saving throw. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> oh, fuck. Oh, boy. This is going to be great. Oh, boy. Uh, tech save. Oh, claim another. All right. We love these. Don't worry. All orcs know how you. to swim. <laughs> okay. Somehow I don't believe you. So... Gideon, you can see, yeah? Yes. Good. You can see that Mikael, while trying to talk to you, just suddenly starts fucking slipping into the water. Please make a, <laughs> please make a dexterity saving throw to see if you can keep your friend from falling into the river. And you know, drowning. Nope. <laughs> Alright, I, uh... have, I have good news and potentially upsetting news. The good news is, you go, whoosh, oh, it's Climb. not it's not that deep. It's like five feet. The bad news is Splash. Okay. Oh my god, I cannot uh my my Or Perfect. Uh -huh. By my milky silk buttocks. Uh, by her <laughs> <laughs> by her by her grace. I just uh... Okay, help me out, and he'll just raise up his hand to help him climb out of the fucking riverbank. <laughs> oh, or can he climb out on his own? He didn't climb out. I mean, it, it, you only, it was only a problem because you're blind. You just walked over the edge. <laughs> like, what the fuck, dude? <laughs> so is this edge right here? Am I good right here? Or do I need you're to good take now that you point? see the edge. You can't see. Oh, okay. that's, why, that's why it happened. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Uh, okay, now that I'm yeah, fucking yeah. wet. Yes, yes. Thank God for... Thank Matheria for my height. Anyways, uh, is he dead? Uh, not yet, but we need to interrogate him. Why? I thought we were interrogating the, the, the village elder. Why are we interrogating this random buffoon? Well, we don't know that he's random. He could also be an elder. We saw... The Elder, how they interacted with him. Did he, no, he, no he, 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 we saw who we thought was the Elder. Okay, but... You know, the... I, would rather, I would rather be safe than... We'll get our chance to kill him, don't worry. Just help me get him inside. Uh, fine. I'm gonna drag his fucking body. Alright, dragging body. Meanwhile, back over the fuck here... How loud was the splash? You heard it. Okay. All right, he will first move up here and say, there's definitely something happening over there, Miss Thorne. One of the lights in the building just went out and I heard a loud splash in the distance. All right. They might be in combat. Alive? Thorne heard the splash. Yes. She did not see mm. the light go out. Thank you. I'll move that. All right. Mm. Are you armed and ready? I'm always armed. Cause I'm a monk. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I have two arms. <laughs> mm. Yeah, and then he'll do action he dash. Well, he he does have it out, but I can always kick people. That's true. Oh wow. Well. That's true. He can do roundhouses. Um, I will. The cover's broken. I mean, I said that there was a loud splash, one of the lights went out, and something is happening, and then... Fair enough. Just making sure the action triggers. So we will light up. He will move to there with his dash action, and then... Hold up. Scope up. <clears throat> Thorn... Sorry, I had a trigger. Thorn feels... <laughs> coming from the north. Hmm. 
Mythos, Mythos, Mythos. Wrong way. And she'll be what? pointing and the pendant will be lit up. And point heresy is that way. Back to your turn. Yeah. Okay. Um I'll try to get to the others as quick as I can and then we'll get let them know. And then I'll try to get back to you as quick as I can. I I'll stay here then. Right. So yeah, he'll finish his dash and then end his turn. Gideon. Uh All right. Well, Stop right there, criminal scum. You're under arrest. The unconscious man does not respond. Yeah, and I'll put the uh, Matherian shackles on him. Not the collar, but the shackles. Uh, and then I'll gag him and I will throw him through. Well, no. I'll just drag his body, action dashing, to bring him back into the building. All right, you can't do all that at once. Okay, okay, okay. Well, then I'll just, uh... Because it's an action to use the shackles, yeah. yes? Action to okay. shackle, yeah. Alright, well then I'll just pick him up and drag him to the... Alright, picking well, no, him up. Like... So you're picking him up and dragging him inside, yeah? Actually, no, like, this, the, the silence is still going here. I'll just chunk him through, I'll just... Throw him, him through, through the, window? the window? Well, not throw, but... Pick him up and put him through the window. Okay. Because it's, it's not going to make noise, so. Yeah. And that's how I'll get him back inside. Alrighty. I'll do that. And I will step inside as well. And get to here. And uh, give a thumbs up to Ariel saying mission complete. Alright, you see a thumbs up. Actually, well, no, you don't. Can't see <laughs> you don't see or hear him saying any of that, and you don't see her. Well, you see her. But she, I can see her. Yeah, but she can't <laughs> hear you say. Hey, I'm doing this now. Go ahead. What are you doing? That the rest can't see. What are you doing, Charles? <laughs> I will let concentration on the side and spell go. Okay. I will be right. People do be talking, though. Mm -hmm. What do people be saying? I don't know. Charles turns it off, walks in, and says, Now that's done. Oh. Okay. <clears throat> <laughs> okay. What's up next, Captain? Why did you have me turn off the light? In case someone came looking, they would see uh, the lights were out and would not be too suspe suspicious because it would just seem like he was gone to bed. So we couldn't pull curtains or anything of that nature. We just went for the light. Got it. All right. <laughs> I understand a bit better now. Thank you. I thought something else was going amok. That's why I thought the light had to be turned out. Alright. So, now that I'm standing here in the dark, hoping to God I don't trip over anything... Metharia. ...to our dear lady, hoping mm -hmm. to her that I don't trip over anything... No es mi dio. Mm -hmm. Es dia, dia. Mm -hmm. Ah, good God in heaven. Ah, good goddess in heaven. All right, so she. All right, so we have one unconscious individual. We can't see for shit. Thanks. And where is Grace? He's just outside the door. Okay. Get us ass in here. He's loud and very large. 
All right. Oh boy, I can't see Mythos anymore, so we will just here. And so, does the pendant have to be like taking a hand slot, or is it around the neck? It's around your neck. Okay. Okay. Then I would like to equip my flails and ready to attack a attack anything that or attack foes in reach. You got it. And other than that, another perception check. I guess we're inside the house. Okay. No change. Oreo? Still snoring. Go ahead, Oreo. Mm -hmm. Oreo. Oreo, your turn. No. Oreo. Yay. Somebody's eating Oreos. Milk's favorite cookie. Milk's favorite cookie. I was going to say, I, I didn't realize I was playing my halfling right now. The shit. I'm making this job a hell of easier. All right. Uh, Let's see here. Can't exactly interrogate or command or do anything with this individual as they are unconscious. I don't know how the hell we're going to extract any information from him. And I'm not exactly hearing much. So could I perhaps roll perception to see if there's going to be, I don't know, any impending trouble? Because I can't think of anything else they really do right now. And I'm open to suggestions. You roll perception check. All right. Please be so kind. You don't hear anything. I'm waiting for stream to catch up because I don't see the score. You rolled a five. Wow. That's sad, huh? Okay. I don't know what we can do from here. I was under the impression we were going to be trying to extract information, but that's not really working. And we have no idea where the perceived elder is at, and this individual is not properly unconscious, so interrogating him isn't going to really pan out. So, do we just kill him and move to the so, next house? To be clear, the reason you're still in combat is because you all are not in a safe spot yet where you can become hidden again. You're all separated, so that's why you're in combat. Okay. Okay. I really don't want to pull a Jane way, but it looks like I'm going to have to, whether I want to or not. I'm going to have to probably kill the unconscious man and regroup to abbreviate and see what we can do from there, because quite frankly, um... Or you, I, that's a stable situation. You can just go into the next house and keep on searching for target. The individual is not going to stay unconscious permanently, so he could wake up and cause a ruckus, which would destroy what Handcuffed we have. Gagged. Oh. Um, Thanks to Gideon's work. I'm sorry, I don't know what else I can really do here. Lead your party forward to the next house. Okay. So or, or all right, all right. Let me help you. Like you can do that, or you can just gather up everybody and go back the way you came, away from the village, with your prisoner, and interrogate him there. That sounds a lot safer than... You can just do that. Like, mm -hmm. I'm sorry. I'm stuck overanalyzing all the things. Trying to make sure that... I'm just I helping you. I'm just helping you. There's so I many understand. I, I understand. That's why it's like, suggestions are great, because... Ah. So, let's grab them and get the fuck out of here. There you go. We'll tell them that. Get in, grab him. We're going to run up there, make camp, and interrogate this poor fool. Okay. Now that you've said that, I can take us out of this. Okay. <clears throat> Who's carrying him? I will carry. You got it. What the fuck? How do you carry him? Over my shoulder. Okay. You know, right. Like you put right. any deer you no take down. Carry. Are you guys? No, hell no. Are you guys Except gathering princess. up together? That's what I'm hoping for. 
for a brief moment, there was a crossbow pointed at Gideon as they came rushing out of the house, but Mythos disciplined right. and did not pull the trigger. The group comes up. Uh, what happened? We have a prisoner. We're going into the woods, making camp, and figuring out what the hell this whole moves. We'll start from there. It'll minimize noise. Okay. Captain. Okay. I heard a lot of ruckus. I heard a scream and a splash. The you... lights went out, so... It wasn't pretty. I did that. Also, Charles here, I uh, thought it would be. Miss Thorne <laughs> activated something and said that there is some sort of heretical magics coming from the north. She wanted me to inform you all of that. Thorne, of has got Harry. Sounds like a plan. Let's go. Back to you. He's us, okay. Back. Thorn, perception check. Others are coming. Like shit. Please continue. Mm. <laughs> on, I'm back, Miss Thorne. The others are coming. All right. Oh, they've captured a prisoner. Understood. Yeah, we're just gonna what do you see that way? Moving. Uh, well, as we move towards here and the group starts to catch right. up and Thorne says that, I will take a look that way. When you get to about here, Gideon, you see this yeah. door open. <clears throat> and you will hear a voice say, Hello? Is anyone out there? Oh. Gideon sees this. Can anybody else tell where she is by the sound of her voice? Uh, everyone else hears, Hello? Anyone out there? It's an old lady. I'll just whisper to uh, Ariel. I crouch to activate my sneak vision and have the eyes start to close. I'm <laughs> <laughs> oh shit, I crouched. <laughs> Arcade on question, could I do like a perception check or a survival maybe to see if I could find out exactly where she is because all I heard is her voice? Yeah, you can make a perception check. Okay. It was going to be a smart house and be like, hold, wait for her to go back to the house. <laughs> All right, well, you can tell him that. Better tell me quick, because if I find out where this bitch is, I'm about to kill her. <laughs> hold. I'll, I'll put my hand on Hello? Miguel's shoulder, and I'll just shake my head no, and Excuse hold me. a finger up to my mouth. Nipples, is that you? <laughs> You silly kitty, come back in immediately. Nipples? Fine then. Stay outside. See if I care. Shuts the door. <sighs> Is okay, she's back inside. Why didn't you just inside. let me kill her? We need to prison her at a time. No, we could have just killed her and moved on. That was an old woman. Could it be had that her and moved on? Fine, 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 fine. Norn. Easy. We're not heading north yet. This is the most complicated kill everyone mission I've ever been a part of. Alright, I'm gonna move the party now. Where would you like what to do go? You see? What do you see to the north? Into the woods. Nothing. It's d too dark right now. But the rest of the group is coming. Go back the way we came. They have a prisoner. Gideon, you see that there are some steps leading up. There's some stairs to the north. We could just go to where the heretical thing is and set up camp there. That'll work. Please. Oh. Okay. Well, let's let's do that then. <clears throat> okay. Make a chain. Don't get lost. Everywhere you, you go, going up to Thank the you for north. The hand. Okay, it's a bit, bit left. Okay, oh, give me a second. 
You see some magic up ahead flowing all around. I hate it. Look at all that mm -hmm. heresy. Mm -hmm. Is it glowy? Can we mm -hmm. can we see the area because of the small amount of light? Yes. Yay. Mm. All right, it's Gideon it's shivers with way. cringe. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it keeps on walking closer. I'm shitting and cringing. Leads. You know, it looks on the floor. There's something up ahead. Hmm? I don't think you should get too close to it just yet. Oh. What is it? Uh, well, mainly two spikes coming out of the ground, and I think some etchings on the floor. Bird. I suspect rock. this might be the druid circle. This looks like it is what Can came I from. use my arcana eyes to try and figure out what all this means? Yeah. Yay. Yay. I could roll. Fucking finally, thank God. All right, this is, in fact, the Druid Circle, but there's something precarious about it, something strange. It's not a full circle. It seems... It seems not to be a full circle, but rather almost like an attachment to another. And then you begin to realize, Mythos, that this is only the branch of this heretical tree. This circle seems to be taking in power from another source nearby. Perhaps, if you spent some time studying the symbols, you could find where the actual circle is, the main one in which this smaller one draws its power from. And do I think it's safe to approach and just in general? I mean, you no, know, no, it's no. kind of gross, but yeah, you could. Yeah, it's cringe. <laughs> it's cringe her heresy. Okay. It appears to be safe to approach, but this is um, a druid circle. But it's not, um, how should I say that? It's not the main one. Whatever mm -hmm. this smaller circle is, is pulling power from somewhere else. If I have some time to look over it, I might be able to get us the actual location of where it's pulling its magics from. How long can you do that? Uh, unknown. It depends on how much information I can get based off of the sigils and arcane scriptures that are on the circle itself. Then take your time, but if you would walk me about it so we can check with, or at least take Gideon around to check for any traps or other troubles. Well. I'll keep an eye on the prisoner. Are, you are, are, are there any religious symbols anywhere here? Um, who are my foreigners again? Uh, none at the moment. What? Oh, right, because you're... Yeah. Okay. I don't remember. He's a quote-unquote foreigner. No. Uh, sure, maybe a rel Do you have religion trained? Yes. Roll it for me. Oh. I think Charles has it trained as well. This isn't Matheria. This isn't Matheria. Why would I know this? <laughs> the, this is not a god. This blasphemy. Holy, what is this? Holy what this is heresy. <laughs> Whoa, dude. <isn't> <laughs> I am. Uh, well, what you see is some fucking childlike drawings that are shitty. There's no way that's a religious symbol. That's stupid. <laughs> that's not Metheria. In fact, you know what? You could do that better with no hands. <laughs> I could probably do that with, you know, what? not the place of time. All right. While you guys figure out what to do, I'm going to go to the bathroom real quick. Be back. All right. All right, guys. Are you guys going to allow me to torture this prisoner up here? Yes. Uh, oh. Well, Ariel said she was gonna watch it, watch him. Well, yes. I'm gonna... I'm gonna... Can I can I torture this prisoner up here? While Please. you're arranging how 
You're going to finish <sighs> interrogation Please. without causing trouble. I, I understand. May I stand by the stairs, at least, since Gideon and I are the ones that can see right now? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I understand your enthusiasm. The problem is, is that if he makes too much noise, given how close we are to the others, we might get swamped. No, no, no. I, I have. Listen, I won't explain how I know how I'm going to interrogate him to get to answers, but I have my ways. He's going to squeeze his balls. No, 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 no. Worse. Now, I'm asking you, out of character, are you going to allow me to torture this prisoner? Are you going to do so quietly so we can extort information from him in a coherent yes. way that isn't going to be some idle confessions? Yes, 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 yes. <laughs> Trust me. <laughs> I got this. Very well. We have spare hostages. But keep it quiet. Yeah. <laughs> uh, thank you, Ward. Tell me when you see anything and good again. I'm going to... Uh, I guess I'll wait to drag him until Arcadum comes back. Ariel, do me a favor. Uh, lay on hands him one HP, so he's conscious. When I dry, when I tell you to. I am not going to waste a spell slot. I'm on a prisoner. However, well, you can't do one. It'll be five. Exactly. <laughs> oh, it's five full HP. Okay. Well, I mean, we have no way to wake him up without healing him. So you, you could just wait. That's true. Healer's kit. Question. That's mark. also true. I don't have one. Charge on him. He's going to die anyways. I believe I might have healer's kit, so that way I could help with the not cringe magic. Mm -hmm. Magic my... cringe? I'm using magic to make... solve this. I can make a healing vape with my sensor stuff because I have a sensor kit. <laughs> Hold up. <laughs> Hold up. <laughs> Blown fat clouds, bro. <laughs> this is a heretic and not a follower of Bethera. We're not going to be wasting holy smoke on some prisoner. Okay? okay? You want to complete the mission, no? Yes, I do. So we wait. We use what we have to to get the information. Yeah, it's called not the holy smoke. Let's slap a band aid and see what happens. Also, do you have to have? Do you happen to have a small blade on you? Usually, no. why? Can I borrow it? Sure. Fantastic. Thank you so much. By the way, did you ever complete the medicine course? Yes. Okay. I stabilized. Yeah, the traitor Yagul when he was bleeding out. Goody. That'll be fun to get revenge one day. Did we lose our Kadem? No, he, he, might be back in the yes. he might be taking, you know, a deuce, so it might be a little bit. Ah, doing the Nara and taking a fat shit. Got it. Yeah. <laughs> yes, 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 yes. Oh, damn it. Let's bunk down against the wall. Pretty much. Hug down against the wall, stay out of sight. Not that, not very helpful anyway, because, again, dark. We should crouch since we're up a bit. Yep. Take the prisoner, get the information, and work from there. Um, I wonder. What am I allowed to swap spells? What information do we want some? from this guy anyway? Uh, let's see. So. <laughs> Uh, where the magic your... circle is. Yes, we're going to want what to know where... Druids and apostates, if he is mm -hmm. apostate. 
what he possibly who is their leader RPGs. yeah mm -hmm. who's your father and what does he do exactly okay so we need to know who their leader is where the other circles are and to answer your question if boy, this you is the game. only village you need to do a long rest to I'm back. re prep your skills. Okay. Yeah, I figured that was the case. Thanks. P yeah, is complete. Yeah. Cool. What's well, your plan? My notes. Uh, I'm going to drag this guy up against this tree. Which tree? This one. Okay, that's Lean him against this tree. I want to wake him up because I'm going to interrogate him now. Remember, he has the, the gag in his mouth, so... <laughs> Alright, here we go. Just wait. Uh, he will wake up. Oh. Hello, friend. You see, I'm sure you know who we are. He's gonna take out a blade in his hand and grab one of his hands that are shackled. I'm going to ask you three questions. Now, if you don't give me answers I want... You're going to lose one of your fingers. Now, in doing so, see the magic thing is, is that by the by the grace of Metheria, I am a paladin, and I can heal you as I chop off your fingers. We could stay here all night long, as I slowly dismember you piece by piece, and your friends will not come save you. You will die a horrible, shameful death by alone in the woods. Now, if you answered my questions, I will leave it up to my captain if you are to live or die. Me? I would just cut off your head and throw your body into the river. She is more soft than I. Are we clear? These are the three questions I want. One, who is your leader? Two, what are your other circles? And he'll turn to... turn to, uh... Captain, ah, uh, Captain, what was the third one once again? We were asking for who's the leader, the location of the leader, and the location of the circles. Ah, yes, that it was. All right. The third is, where is your leader? Who and where is he and what are the other circles? Now, before I remove this gag, if you yell, I will just re-gag you and torture you slowly. We are far enough from your village, no one will probably heal you. And that's it. My friend there, over to my left, this wonderful preacher, he can cast silence quickly. And we have lots of, we have lots of opportunity to do so. The screams will not be heard. So, oh, uh, out of character mechanics question, because uh, I'm not sure how the spell yeah. works. If he were to, if he were to cast, say, silence here, Oh, hold on, like ahead of him, in this area, would the sound pass? Like, does it act as a barrier? Like he would just scream and then the silence would stop? No, it doesn't work that way. Uh, okay. si silence is no sound goes in it, no sounds goes out of it. So mm -hmm. it, it it doesn't it doesn't work like a wall. It's not a wall. Yeah, it's a bubble. Yeah. If we were in a cave and the bubble like hit ceiling to floor, it would probably stop it. But we're out in the open. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And you guys do have some arrangement to detect thoughts and zone of truth that I paid good money for back at the church. I was not aware you had zone of truth. Ariel does. Nice. Yes, I do not know if it's prepared. I think it's a. Let me look. Oh, thank you. Yeah. No, it is not prepared. And it is not a ritual, so it, we would have to wait for it. <clears throat> so, what's it going to be? So here's here's the problem. If if we do it so that way I have command and I have uh, zone of truth, it'll you'll unfortunately have to wait. But at least we'll be able to extort the information out. Well, he could still give the information. I would say do it now. And if he doesn't, if it's not answers you like, then we can just wait till later. 
And then reserve it for the, uh, then change up later, I guess. Okay, fine. So is the game plan, we're gonna, you're gonna zone a truth and command him to give you questions or answers? No, 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 no. I can't do any of that right now because I would need a rest to get those. So unfortunately that's null and void. I can't fix that now. So we're gonna have to do with the original plan of, hi, we're going to have to engage in torture and we're gonna make this work. And if you think you can scream, uh, your vocal cords will go missing. It's it's sloppy, it's not pretty, but unfortunately it's what we got. Cool. Well, we can't rip out his vocal cords, he won't be able to tell us. Ah! Feeling what? is it a wonderful thing, isn't it? All right. Who is, who is paper? Yeah, that's another question. We can just have him write it down if he screams. Mm, actually, I think it would be better if we have How's he going to do that if you cut his fingers off? That's true. I'm aware, but there are multiple stages to this. I also have <laughs> another thought in mind. Have him write uh, it down, and if he disobeys, then punish him? No, no, Try no. With the toes? Okay, above board. I want, uh, I want to, before I, I'm going to add gag him above board, I want Charles to cast silence as I ungag him and see if he tries to scream. Therefore, I know that he's going to try to yell anyway. Then I'll just cut off one of his fingers. Consider spell slots. Okay, so, yeah, that that is also fact right there. So that's why I would recommend, since he's already gagged and shackled, mm. have him write the answers. If he doesn't cooperate, we'll punish him. Okay. We still Someone have control and we don't waste spell slots or health potions. So let's go. Cool. Someone give me a piece of paper and a pen if we can. I have <sighs> my book and things. Yes. So we'll open Here. the satchel and tear out a couple of pages and keep the rest of myself and hand over the various art supplies. Okay. Uh, oh god. Oh god. Wow. ASMR. Not okay. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I'm, I'm fucking starving. Forgive me. <laughs> starving. Forgive me, forgive me. No, you're good. All right, we'll give the guy the paper. We'll give the guy uh, a couple art supplies so he can write his answers. Call it good from here. All right, hold on. Let me let me make this more appropriate. And I I am keeping a watch down here by the steps to see if, if anybody approaches. Okay. And I rolled a twenty. I rolled no. a twenty on that perception check. Now do me a favor. <laughs> Give me the right answers. I don't want to prolong this now. I would love for you to give me the wrong ones so I can brutally skin you alive. But do as you want, warrior. Here is your paper. Here is your pencil. Please do as the following, or I will take this pencil and shove it into your face. Grace. Thank you so much. You're not helping. Gosh. Go on. I hand out the pen and pencil, or the pen and paper, and I'll uh, stand up. So, are the shackles behind his back or in front of him? I think they front shackled him. Okay. Yeah, front shackled him. All right, well, he's at one hit point. Did you cure his bleed? I would, yes. Okay. And I would use uh, one charge out of the med kit to make it so. Alrighty. The man is awakened. And you have explained all of this to him. You've had him a piece of parchment and a uh, quill. Now what? Uh... Can I roll intimidation to try to make him cooperate? Uh, so he does answer our question. You can certainly try. Okay. Well, if intimidation doesn't work, persuasion hopefully will. Well, he's not going to try to persuade him. I was referring to me. Oh, well, maybe you can. All 
All right. He will make a saving throw versus fear. <laughs> oh, I made him shit his pants. <laughs> he will expend a point of grit and automatically succeed that. Fuck. He will oh, look you. Grit. He will look you right in the eye, unafraid. That's right. He has grit. Oh. Fuck. Are you going to answer my questions? You still you have. Still you, die you, being you, brave. you still have the fucking gag in his mouth. But he's got the pen and paper. He's not writing. He's not answering what? the questions. Oh, okay. He will start to write things down in the parchment. It's so Bro. loud, merciless. It's like so... it's. Oh, I thought I muted. No, oh it God. is so fucking loud, dude. Mm, crunchy. All right, he will. Um... He will start to write some things down. What were your questions again? Uh, uh, who is the elder? Uh, where is the elder? And where is the main branch of the circle? Mm -hmm. Okay. All right, he will finish writing. Thank you. I'm typing it out for you now. I really so to be clear, it. your questions were, who is the elder? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Where is the elder? Mm -hmm. And the third one was? Where's the main branch of the Druid Circle? The answers he writes down is Elder Brian, at his home, I think, and in the mountains. What is his home? He will look down at the paper, and he will write. In flow pedal. Where's flow pedal? You are standing in it. Perfect. Is there anything else you think we need, Captain? We will need specifics in regards to the location of the mountains. Fantastic. Turns and to we him. will need specifics as to where in flow pedal the house is. I would rather not make this louder than it needs to be. Yes, see, whoever you are, we're here to speak to you out there. The southwestern go... end. Okay. Um, oh, good. Any identifiers on this house? He'll write, it's nice. Is it much nicer than the other helms around it? He'll just shrug. Please do not test Is my there patience. a garden or anything in particular? Like a bench? He will, he will in write in. Us. His mother lives with him. Hmm. Does she have a cat named Nipples? He'll nod. Thank you. <laughs> okay. Anything else you think we need, Captain? 
I would like specifics on the circle, but the Elder might be able to help us out a bit better. Anything else you think we need from him? No. Giving you a look? Fantastic. He will Fantastic. Mikael draws his sword and tries to hold cut on. off this guy's fucking head. As hold you on. do so, he will hold up his shackles and you will cut through the shackles instead. Roll initiative. Okay. He will hold his hands up. Brilliant. All right. I will stand up. I will dash. Does that provoke or no? Yeah. Okay. But our shackles are only on his wrists. Yeah, no, but I'm saying they bro they're broken now. Now we have one less shackles. Yeah, Sag. Sag, big Sag. Those broken shackles are coming out of your hide, Grace. All right, you miss. Dear God, bro, I can't fucking hit anything today. Uh -oh. All right, all right. As a mind interaction, he'll t as an item interaction, he'll tear the gag out of his mouth. And he'll yell. Yeah. Uh, hearing that, and I'll turn and see him and run up and try to. All right, now every, now we're all gonna roll. Yep. Because I didn't think I would be close enough to warrant an attack of opportunity. Ah, uh, you're good. No, you're good. You're good. Because I would have been able to see him coming for a bit, so. Let me see what we can do. I can't see the carousel. Yeah, I don't know why the carousel oh. isn't popping. That was weird. Huh. Alright, there we go. And we disappeared. Alrighty, Mythos. You gain initiative. Alright. Shoot so him. as they were making noise and all that, I will move uh, here. I want to stay here. Oh. If there is light guide this strike, and then I will try to sh just shoot him with an arrow. Okay. Is this at disadvantage because we're in the dark? Yep. That'll miss. <sighs> oh no. Sing. And so it doesn't shoot on our teammates. <laughs> it doesn't. I, I don't use critical for that. God, I used to though. Yeah, I know. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I know. <laughs> I was worried. All right, like, it is now like, Thorn's turn. <laughs> Obviously, Thorn is not affected by the night. Yep, and so to target. Go. That'll miss. Wait, can he see in the dark? Yes. Damn. Mm -hmm. I'll try it, Thorn. The other one. That will also miss. Great. And then I guess we'll just do a martial check. Torn. You can also action search. Mm -hmm. If you want to try again. You know, it... Yeah, let's, let's action surge and salvage the situation. Action surge, very well. Let me pop that into the chat. There we go. That'll hit. There you go. Okay. That, that's that's plenty. All right, he's fucking gone. He falls on the ground. Dead. You, you can kill him if you want. You got an extra swing. I don't. I think he's dead. He only had one HP. So he's no, down. He, he's he, not dead. He's down. Oh, okay. No, some of us have restraint, but we will hiss like. Are you oh. fucking mental? We got everything we needed from him. There's no point to leave him alive. Well, I'll deal with him. We'll do the second flail and crush at it. At advantage. Oh. Thank you. Sorry, I wasn't quick enough on the draw. I was trying to look over no, the circle still. You're... you're fine. You're fine. It's okay, friend. All right. He is dead. 
Hmm. And just like, shudders down the spine. The crack and crunch and shoulder. Right. We know where the Elder is. I'm gonna go back to here and go back to perception check watch. Mikael, why was he running over here? Why did this become my problem? He escaped from his chains and tried to run after we interrogated him. Alright. Did you get your information? We got good information. He does not know where the other suckers are, but we know where the village elder mm -hmm. You know that woman? You told me not to uh, run up and kill her? He lives with her. Hey, hey guys, could y'all do not do this right here? I need to be able to hear if somebody's approaching. And you're being a little loud. He? Oh, he's, he's like whispering to her. Um, so, the woman that was looking for I nipples. Like, I don't think I felt anyone else in that house. Did you have any, like, did you have any zone of truth on him? No, but. You ran in. You ran an inquisition without any verification. Uh, Ariel could not have it ready. If we waited much longer, if say if we waited for the morning, they were going to notice him missing, and then we would have lost our moment of uh, limit of surprise anyway. You two were underprepared. This imperils our mission. I hope you'll keep this in mind moving forward. Me, have you learned okay. anything useful? No, that's going to take hours for him to do that. Mm -hmm. I would like to read the inscriptions in the circle and the stone surrounded, as I can read Riddick. How? Proselytizer. Oh, polyglot. oh, polyglot, polyglot. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. Well, you can see that it appears that from the Druidic writings on the stone, um, it is indicative that this, as to Mythos's suspicion, is in fact one of the ancillary circles. It's a connective point. It also has the markings of the name of this town, which is Flow Petal. Hmm. I do agree that this is only. A tip of an antel point. That is something marine that makes sound like they're trying to get a crown of a crown of a deer. But that would explain the two weird groves like antlers. I think if we disrupted this circle here, that it would have some adverse effect on the main branch that it's coming from? Or should we leave it as is and go deal with the... I'm not sure. Uh, we might be able to shut it off, but I'm not entirely sure this is... I, I might be able to understand and read the language, but it, it's arcane secrets flips me. Not my speciality. Can Mythos working together with Mr. Charles make another check to see if it would, if there would be any merit to turning you've this already, off or destroying it? You've already made the checks. It just takes time yeah. to decipher that. Okay, then yeah, they'll just keep going over that until. Okay. Do we want to focus on divining the circle here or obtaining the elder? You said that you think you can find where the main circle is relative to here, so I think that better aligns with our main objective. Then the question would be, what do we, or how do we want to deal with the rest of the villagers? I didn't necessarily sense druidic magic aside from this. I mean, if they're working with the druids, then they're all heretics. Yes. If possible, we need to see through. this village destroyed. If we can get information on where to go after this to find the greater circle, once we finish up here, we can make moves towards that location to try and get rid of the main issue. So this here is just a branch. On... There could be yeah. more. So Obtain the Elder. Extort the information. Do we want to do that tonight, then, and come back to this later? 
I would say we should attempt so tonight. All right. Do you want us to aid you, or do you want us to stay here and work on this? Um, if we work on this, it might buy time for me to get the Zone of Truth and the command, which will make the interrogation easier. Then we'll be so the question in the daytime. And that is a part of the problem. Mm-hmm. So let's deal with our night work. If you need me, I will go with you. We can work on the circle afterwards. We will need you so that way you can cast mm-hmm. silence to keep, hopefully, everything calm. And I need of your course. eyes to support me first, if you would. Very well. Hold. Gideon. Yes. You hear footsteps approaching. Uh, do I see anybody yet? No. I'm saying you hear footsteps approaching. Do you do anything? Uh, upon hearing footsteps, I will make my way back towards the group. We have company approaching. Understood. Then seal. Hide in the bushes as you can. Do I feel Should we wait for them to come back towards us perception? to keep give them further away yes. from the village? Let's ambush them if possible. Alright, I'll, I'll come over here. And wait. Forward back this way. No, I'm on the other side of the stairs. Okay. Whoever is controlling area, remember to move her. They are going to find the body. (sighs) Actually, it's... Which side did you want to be on, Void? Did you want to be back here behind Charles or up here with Mythos? I'll I'll be fine. Just, yeah, just going right there for now. Okay. We didn't get a chance to mess with the body yet, so we'll see what the reaction Alrighty. is. Alrighty, everyone, pause right there, please. Yep. yep. Hold on a second, sirens. All right. You will hear these two voices. Oh, come on, Mr. Quill. Why we got to do this? It is important, young Thomas, that one doth bequeath themselves of the moonlight. The circle must be maintained, whether it be day or night. Just as with many things of this life. Yeah, but I don't really... Everyone's having a good time, though. I want to celebrate. Ah, yes. But the Elder does this on our behest each and every ten day. We must do this in response as well. Besides, it is good to... What what is it, sir? Tell the elder something is wrong. Blood has been spilt here. What do you guys do? Uh, we can't see them yet from where we're at. Nope. It's still, Stay. It's still Stay. dark. No, we're not going to be able to catch up either. So they get to get the jump. Uh, can we tell what direction the voice is coming from? From the south. It's coming from up the stairs. Gideon can attempt a perception check to see them. Since he can I actually will... see. I will do that. 
Perception. What about Thorn? Can she quote unquote see? No, 30 feet range. Oh. That is a 20. Okay. You see this. You see the man lingers at the bottom of the steps, sniffing the air. Uh, I don't see the other person that's with him. No. All right. They left already. All right. <laughs> I guess we can just wait for the elder to show up. I'm going to mm. wait until they bring more people. I'm going to try to stealth in these trees and wait for the elder to show up. Shit, that's who we're waiting for. I guess they're bringing him to us. No. One guy sniffing the air, Lady Ward. If the elder comes, it doesn't matter whether or not that man is alive. If you're going to take him, take him quietly. Do you want me to take him now or wait? We need to move. Can't just wait. They could be evacuating. Why are we assuming That's... that they're going to come here after us? Because the elder's going to want to know what's wrong. And with this being a druidic circle, he likely will try to confirm its integrity. Thus, he could threaten the circle. Do I think if I did anything to the circle, it'd like trigger an alarm or something? You don't know. You're still studying okay. it. I don't I mean unless they have some sort of special connection with it, I don't think doing anything to the circle will really do anything for us right now. You will then see after a few moments the man begin to back off. And then he fades from your sight, Gideon. Alright, he's gone. Better Very study well. the circle first. Okay. Study as quick as you can. Take it notes as you can. I think somebody okay. should head back to the to the stairs to see if they're starting to evacuate. You would be the best person for that because you have the dark vision. Alright, can I take Thorn with me? I see no I reason why not. Alright. I'm with you. Alright. Uh Thorn and I will head down towards the uh the stone stairs that lead up the cliff. Oakley Doakley. Speed study. Girls work with him. I don't know where I can help. Mikael, didn't you say you, uh, this probably wouldn't be our cup of tea? Religion perhaps wouldn't help here. Arcana would, though, and you are good at that. Perhaps that could work? Not enough. Uh, I do have, I have, I have, I do know magic, but not enough. Super specific, what do you need? Mm, I was just trying to think of a way to help speed things along for these two. Uh, Arcadev, could I help him try to study? Or do I not have Arcana trained if enough you, if to you help don't, him? If you don't have them, do you have the skill trained at all? I thought you did, my bad. I don't think so. Well, if you don't have okay. the skill trained, then you can't help. Nah, I have survival, religion, and... Marshall. That's on me then. My bad. Alright, Gideon and Thorn, you are moving towards the stone steps to see if anyone escapes. You don't see anyone there. Uh, I think we should hunker down here for right now, just to keep a watch on the village to see if there's any more movement. Understood. Um, I'll be with you. Keep an eye out. Alright. I'll hunker down in the bushes next to the to the steps and and watch and wait. I will hunker around the apple tree. Okay. Uh, how would how should I do this? Let's let's do let's finish up with this first. So, as you continue to study, about a total of thirty minutes or so have passed. Make me another Arcana check, Mythos. 
Even though uh, I don't think Charles is trained in Arcana, can I do advantage since he's translating the Druidic on here to help? Like, yeah, that's fine. So with the twenty, at the end of your studies, this is what you think. This circle is receiving mana from the main circle. Disrupting this circle would probably diminish the power of the druids in the area, but it would also alert the main circle that something is wrong, because they will have detected that this circle is off. Okay, I think I figured this out. And then he'll go down. Captain. So from what I'm able to gather from this, this circle is just a branch. It's receiving mana and other magics from the main circle. That's how the druids that are here are maintaining their power. Mm. If we disrupted it, it would weaken them, which would make it easier for us to take over the area. Problem is... If we do anything to disrupt this circle, the main circle that it is take, pulling its mana from, anyone monitoring it will be alerted that something is wrong here. So if we're going to get into combat, we're either going to fight the druids at their full strength, but not alert the main circle so we can have a chance at going after them later, or we can weaken them so that we can deal with them here, but it'll make the final assault on the main circle more difficult. I personally would prefer not to alert the main circle for fear of foes that we could not overcome. Very well. Then we need to make sure that there are no survivors from this village. Because even if we don't disrupt anything, if a single person lives and they do anything to this, the main circle will be alerted. She will turn to Mikael. And you'll see a very small smile grow into a blood-chilling sneer. You have your orders, Grace. Search oh, and destroy. Finally, thank you but so much. But keep the Elder alive. Trenton turns to Mythos. Do you know where the main circle is? Uh, did I get an idea of the at least general direction? Yeah. From my research? Which way? Uh, it's just further north. Uh, further north. Do we still need him alive if we have that? Yes, I want confirmation. We are not to be stuck. Remember, we have a short timetable. Uh, and if he knows Our the dad... exact location, that'll be easier. North exactly. I thought it was just... Wide I, range. Thought... I thought our timetable was just this village. I was under the impression we were supposed to destroy a Druidic circle. This is but a branch. But it is a circle indeed. This was your trial run. You don't have to go after the main headquarters. No, that is not. Okay. Your mission is this village and this circle. Okay. Um, okay. I missed that. Atom. I figured that's what he was leading at. He, uh, the main branch is... No. He, the, your, your initial trial mission is not to take out the main headquarters of the druids. <laughs> That is nearest to the pill. No, no. But how many brownie points would we get? Like, I mean, I mean, look, look. I'm gonna be honest. If you got, if if you if you guys want to do that, that's up to you. That's fine. I'm just saying. We're probably outmanned for that. Just, just. Out yeah. of board. Yeah. Look, man. Outmanned for that. You do whatever you want. Okay, I'll be laughing the whole time anyway. It doesn't matter. <laughs> Do whatever you like. No, I, I think we I should focus on clearing the village, and then we can get message back to Inspector and Inquisitor Trent. All right, let me let me walk through it again. So, there are expectations of a main druidic circle. Yes. Killing whom you can find, gathering information. This is the trial part. Yes. The intention for a trial mission is for you to conquer a smaller branch, not to take on the main one. Yes. But that doesn't mean you. Like, 
he's not going to be mad at you for taking out the big one, too, but that's not what's expected of you, no. If we have time, let's... let's <laughs> if we have time, first. we'll just take out all of them. <laughs> no, anyway. <laughs> we have, what, six days left? We had a week, we've traveled, no, no, no. More. we've got we seven days left, six days. Week. We have three days, because it's two days of travel there, two days travel back, so we have three days to get this figured out. Let's go. Wait, I thought it started when we got there. And we got a week after we landed. Yeah. Or was I mistaken? Okay. No, that's what? correct. Oh, I misunderstood. Um, but, so, um, Captain. Go. Yes. There is something that uh, that strikes me a little bit with nervousness. That it speaks of a crown. Well, um, elaborate. I am not much sure of it, but. It might, I would need to study more of it when we get back to the headquarters, but I am a little afraid of what it might mean. What are you afraid that this means? That this is something much more dark and sinister than just a mere circle. Is it all the more reason for us to destroy it now? If, if what Mipha says is true and it will alert the main branch, I would suggest we don't. That was my preference. Unfortunately, our orders are to just find the Druidic Circle and tear against and do da, 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 da. She's looking at the scroll intently. Once huh. we eradicate the village, we can use your Pegasus to call forth Inquisitor Trent. Copy that. If we take over the entire area and no one else is able to access the circle, even if we don't destroy it, well, at we can at least get communications to him, and then we can. And then he would make the best be call. Better, mm -hmm. yes, to break it now to get this heretical, malignant magics out of the area, or if they would be more suited to having us do a full pronged assault on the main circle without their knowledge that anything has gone awry. Yep, better for him to pull the trigger than us at this point. Saying that the objective is to destroy the circle, sure, but nope, destroy the circle is right here. It is our job <sighs> to destroy the circle. If we don't do so, we're failing in our mission. We could give him where the main circle is, and he can send us after that. If we don't destroy the circle and leave, we are in fact not doing our mission. That's why I said if we take over the area, we'll always we'll have the option to destroy the circle whenever. But we can communicate with him that it might not be the best course of action. Yes, let's do it that way. I would rather us give every tool to the Inquisition instead of robbing it of an advantage. Also, if we destroy the circle, the fight we're going to have, right, is going to be easier. We're going to make it much more difficult on ourselves than not to not destroy the circle and fight who we have here or we destroy it, have a much easier time wiping out the enemy. But if that's just what you want to do, I'll Grace, do it. who uh, am I to rob you of the opportunity to unleash your full brutality? You love a challenge. Destroy them. <sighs> and get me that elder. light will guide us, regardless of whether they're stronger or not. Uh, agreed, yes. agreed. It's we'll okay. support to their destruction. Okay, friends, if that's what we want to do. Unfortunately. If he, gets, if he gets angry... It's on me. And I'll take full responsibility because it was my suggestion. No, 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 It's no, no. my call. It's her call. I will follow it for group cohesion. But Aww, I spoke in my thanks. Best. Let's get Roll to it, eyes. boy. Go meet with the others. You will have my support, Captain. Let's get to it. Like I said, I would rather us have every advantage than none at all. Even if it's a little bit harder now, it's better than letting the druids have an edge. All right. Later, anyway. Well, what time fun. of day is it, by the way? It's... How deep into the night are we? It's like it's midnight. Midnight. It's okay. Like a... It's like a. It's like ten thirty. Oh, good. Even better. There you go. 
10 30. Drinking a potion, drinking some heroism. <laughs> Wishing it was whiskey. All right. <laughs> heroism is whiskey. <laughs> hey, yo. I like this new cannon. All right, let us get in position and get ready to storm the camp. No one escapes. Keep the Elder alive. Are we clear? Hi. If given Finally. the opportunity to burn down each of the buildings, it'll at least cause a distraction for anyone that's trying to resist. Interesting approach. I like it. Well, we're not exactly going to be quiet anymore, so we might as well make it a big display. Mm -hmm. Remember, the Elder leaves in the village with the old woman with the cat nipples it's time to finally <laughs> I can't I'm sorry any character is calling him laughter I'm sorry uh, you hold yourself nibbles together got you? <laughs> nibbles got you nibbles got you what's wrong what's, what's wrong what's wrong with nibbles it's the fact that Mikael just says it so deadpan is like <laughs> the grandma with the cat named nipples what's wrong with nipples bro the cat nipples. The cat nipples. We have to kill its owners. <laughs> <laughs> we'll, we'll leave the cat alone, but the, the, the people, the people gotta go. <laughs> no, no, I'll kill everything. I don't care. Anyways, we finally get to purge the unclean. I'm ready. We're, we're going in. Captain Gideon. Mm -hmm. Wait, what? What are y'all doing down here? We are destroying everything. Time to get them off quickly before they're able to escape. I'm gonna. Tell we don't have to no be. We're not an option here. Above four. We're not being quiet anymore, right? We're not being stealthy. We're just going house to house, burning everything down now. Mhm. Mm yes. Preferably as a group. Don't kick in every door by yourself, please. But. Okay. I can't stop Mikael from doing that. I That's true, to Mikael. All right. Uh, Mikael's gonna walk into this door and SWAT team kick this bitch open. Well. Where are you gonna put Slippy? Okay, sounds great. Um, mm -hmm. Athletics check. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. Is there a door for that door? Here comes the one. Okay. Hey. The door is blown off its hinges as you enter, and the little old lady will sit up. Oh my goodness! I rush her. Hello? <laughs> Cut her fucking head off. Alright, make an attack. Damage. You cut her head off. The old lady falls on the ground. She is most certainly dead. I'm going to take it. This is a candle, correct? Yeah. All right. I'm going to walk this candle back over, throw it at her bed, and walk out. Okay. Did, did you look for anything else in the house? Remember. First anything thing, heretical. Learn. First you pillage, then you burn. Oh my god. Okay, I walk over and search the house with the candle and for anything heretical. Okay, make perception checks. Mythos? Yes. I will be assisting. Fuck. Me out and see shit. <laughs> There's your one. Oh, there you go. Charles. <laughs> As Mikael storms around the, the house, looking before setting it on fire, uh, you notice that there is the symbol of Metheria above this woman's bed. Oh, no. I would like to go over and look at the symbol, studying if it's any... Oh. Just take the L. You walk over and what? I will look at the symbol, I will look at the old lady, and I would like to... I am sorry. Sorry for what? She is a traitor. She is a believer, nonetheless. T clearly not of her followers. She's working with the druids. 
The man lives in this home. Mikael, you notice that there's no other bed in this house. Well, that's what the person said. Anyway, she lives in through the area and supports it, or she would have reported it anyway. Anything else, friends? She might have been led astray from a furious life, but uh, light, but <sighs> so be it. She now lives in shadow. Well, literally and figuratively. She shall burn with the others. And he'll begin to walk out. And her bed is flammable, correct? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm you're, assuming you're, this whole house is you, fucking you, a candlestick. You, you set it on fire. All right, yeah. I'm gonna fucking toss him in the bed and walk okay. out. Okay. It is at this point. Don't look at explosions. And it's at this point that you start to hear voices coming from the east. Um, can I tell where the front door is on this house? Everyone stop. Okay. As I said, you heard voices coming from the east. Yep, Everyone make turn. perception checks. Oh, I gotta do... Honestly, I feel like my eyes were plucked out. He's, he's just. Oh, well, I, gotta, I forgot to bring Ariel down here. Ah. Mm. Yeah. Apologies. Oh, no worries. Uh. Perception 16. Alrighty then. You can see that there are torches and people coming towards you. You also notice that there is the glint of steel and weapon. They are armored and armed. You have approximately... I'd say about a minute until they're here. Set up Do we know how many? If that doesn't uh, set up. Oh. Perception of 16 would reveal... About six. Huh. <laughs> All right. They're coming. They're armed. The fire is going to draw their attention. Get ready for ambush. Fantastic. We have 60 seconds. Okay. Ready yourselves uh, for hell. Can't that high. Uh, where would you like to go, Void? Uh, where I can do protection. Best. I can't really make it out on the stream. Sorry. Uh, I can put you down here on the corner of this house. Because so, they're coming from here-ish, I would. I'm guessing. Right. Mm -hmm. I can before put you we, before we're moving down here. What are what is the plan? Are we, so we're not just walking around like chickens with head cut off. Try to keep them in the light. Try to keep them in the light. Hide and jump. We can hide and jump if you want. I don't know if we have very much opportunity to do that given our limited time. But my recommendation would be to form up, meet them, and destroy them. This is a wave of six. Where? So, Ariel's setting up here. I. Uh, I think I'll go in this tree with Charles, or behind this tree with Charles. I would like to set up there, but I think that's too far away from people. Uh, wait, before Gideon leaves, does he have torches? No. Damn. The house is about to be burning. Mm -hmm. uh, there's and a there's a big bonfire. Yeah, right but how here. fast does a house burn? These are all made of wood, so fast. These are gonna go up like matches. Either way. And there's a big bonfire there, so I'm not too too worried about the the light. 
Mm -hmm. so uh, above order. We guy, are we still kicking in houses, setting them up, well, waiting for them? They're okay. gonna come to us. So they're it's... gonna be to us in one minute. So unless you can kick in a door, kill any number of people in there, and light the house on fire in ten rounds, then we're probably just fighting them. Pretty much. Well, I was just gonna walk in here, see the light, throw it up, walk back out. I mean, uh, you I mean, can you... do that. Just keep lighting stuff on fire. Yeah, yeah, it's fucking. You want to walk in there and do a quick perception and see what's what's in there, and if there's nothing, light it up, then go for it. Okay. That's what you want to do. Oh, uh, walk into this door. It's fucking, actually, I'm not gonna walk in. Spartan kick this or just well, just open it as fast as I can. Okay, the door is locked. All right, fucking SWAT team, it is. All right, well, I'll roll another athletics for you. All right, well, a 14, uh, you kicked the door and bent it a little bit. You hear movement on the inside. I kick it again. All righty. Uh, this time, you kick the door open, and you see this gentleman. He has a rapier. Okay, fantastic. Who are you? Your executioner. All right, roll initiative. Okay. All right, cool. <laughs> like, all right. <laughs> all right, cool. Didn't even try to hide that one. All right. <laughs> no? No, he's not. He wouldn't. <laughs> no, like this is a dream. No Man. one's breaking into your house. <laughs> <laughs> we, are not, we are not the Methanians you are looking for. <laughs> it's a dream. Oh my god. There's no one here. There is only <laughs> Batman. <laughs> Isn't he like on the coast right now dealing with the uh, other goofballs? Do we want to back him up? I, I think someone inside. Hold on, so I'm about to close. I'm about to roll initiative, so Okay. Yeah. At this point you're all put where you're gonna be, so Yep. Yep. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay, making sure I got everything I need. Nothing bad is gonna burp be a bell. Oh, this man's a whole dojo all by himself? He's an entire oh. dojo by himself, bro. That's crazy. Alright. Here we go. Hold on, I need to set up things and make sure that everything has a torch. Oh. Hey, uh, hey. Merciless, don't forget, if you really want to set stuff on fire, you get that potion of dragon breath. Oh, I forgot, my boy! <laughs> I, I got you, fam! Oh, oh, I could have set him in the house on fire and just walk back out. <laughs> oh, I mean, it'll take your action to, to, to drink it and then another action to use it, but yeah. Yeah. I think. I don't know, look at the details. Uh... I'm pretty sure it, it requires an action to actually breathe it. Can you send that to me? Do you have it? Because it's not in I, my inventory. No, I have it. Oh, she has it. Never mind. Crazy. Check my inventory. I yes, bet it is you. I... Yep. 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 It's oh. in yours. Oh, I okay. guess the captain wants to breathe fire on the houses and light everything. Never up. mind. I don't breathe fire. It's all in my head. head. My bad. Fuck, bro. This would be perfect time for it. Dude, you got him <laughs> hella excited. I did. Yeah, bro, you, <laughs> you, bro, you definitely got my fucking hopes up. And you you acted. You act pulled, the rug pulled out from underneath. You me. activated, uh, <laughs> what is it? Neuron activation? Yes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Purging the unclean neuron activation? Mm -hmm. Yes. Mm -hmm. What dopamine release? I'm flying, he says. Baited, smashed, destroyed, dropped, kicked. It's like we're fading a little bit harder than we should, huh? All right, stab, stab it in, stab, stab. It's gonna be fun, mostly, maybe. All right, here we go. All 
Okay, rolling initiative for everybody. I gotta select everyone. Not the dead old lady. <laughs> <laughs> Whose house is it? Who yes. she's currently being turned Who's to ash? Adam. Bro, I, I was really hoping y'all were gonna do some insight checks to see if he was lying or not, but y'all didn't. I was like, ah, oh, no luck. I think it's hard to do an insight if they're writing it down. No, you can still see their intent. They're still lying. All right, yeah. here we go. I didn't think it could if they were writing it down. That's not ah, bad. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Not right now, anyway. Fucking hell. Bro, we're all rolling like garbage. Hold on, I have to equip them with torches. Oh, I actually fucking rolled hot on initiative. Make sure to pull out the marshals. We want to see which one of these goofballs is an actual druid and which ones aren't. God, they're all partaking mm -hmm. in the cleansing. Mm -hmm. Oh, well, where are Which ones are the magic people? Yeah, cringe, sadness. Oh, fucking, why is that so bright on him? Hold on. Maybe I can make it look. That's the best I can get it to look. Okay. Is it just because yellows are brighter colors, so it's like... I don't know. ...faulting to like higher brightness? In, in either case, um, you will see the following. Let me go through the uh, combatants real quick before we begin. Uh, first, you have Mr. Adojo, who looks like this. He is currently wielding a rapier. Leading, you have Elder Brian. This individual. Although you see that he is carrying an enormous maul, which is actually just a giant log. Oh, oh no, Mikael! Mikael's PTSD. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking time to spin back, motherfucker. You see, um, the man you saw earlier. You can see a middle-aged woman who seems to be carrying a set of full plate mail, a heavy shield, and hammer. You see that there is a fucking nerd behind them. My god. Can't wait to break those glasses. And way in the back, barely following, very curious to watch, is this 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 guy. That guy? That guy's a level 12 monster. Um, oh, and you do see one more. Hold on. For some reason, I didn't catch her. You see this woman. She seems to be scurrying behind them with a worried look on her face. Oh, she, so she's got an ass on her. Too bad. My god. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Less than a minute away. What does that mean? She's letting us know how far they are. Mm-hmm. How far? Who? Who? Who oh, are? No, the the people. The group. Yeah, the group. I don't. I don't. I don't understand. Come on, they're just they're just close. We'll they... see how this goes. Yeah, yeah. Let's go. Are you are you trying to make an argument they shouldn't be that close or something? No, no she's no. just letting us know. No, I'm just like, oh boy, they're right here. Let's go. Yeah, all right. Ogly dogly, here we go. I think I got everything set. Close out the combat. I don't know why the tracker isn't up for chat room. That's really weird. Uh, can you refresh for them? It wasn't up for me, but it came up uh, when I refreshed the. All right, let me try refreshing. Like if you click the carousel, it might pop up. I did. I don't think it. I don't know. Let me refresh for because them. Mine was missing too. And I was like, no, I like seeing the circles. I know so I had to refresh pressure. because when you added the light to the enemies, I couldn't see the torch. And then when I refreshed, it was there. Weird.
Foundry be like that. Mm -hmm. Be how it do. Oh, there, there we go. It's it. popping up for him. All right, good. All right, let's get this fucking show on the road. Bring Metharia's light to these foolish bitch boys. Yes. Amen. Fucking bro. Go ahead, Mikhail. I'm living for this moment. Um. All right, I gotta marshal check the fucking bitch before I start. Good call. Good call. <laughs> bitch, marshal check. Bitch, bitch, bitch. He's a bitch. Come on, open character sheet. Come on. I believe in you. There we go. Yes, this is the music I wanted to hear. 17, what would you like to know about Mr. Dojo? What's his HP? 60. All right, here we fucking go, I guess. All right, just gonna fucking roll up and... Uh... Bonus action, draw, well, I have my sword out already. Yeah. Throw my hand over its blade as I look at him. Your death will be meaningless and cast Define Favor over my blade. Since this guy's important, we're gonna fucking start dumping everything into this guy. Well, I'm gonna get out of the way. I'm gonna smite him. Okay. Wait, wouldn't that be two spells at what time? Or is smite considered different? Smite is not a spell. It's different. Okay, okay, all right. I just have to claim it, because if I don't hit, it doesn't matter. Yeah. Well, no, you all still right. spend the, the spell slot if you miss. Just casting that. Okay. Hold on. This is giving me a, a pop-up. All right, let me, uh... <laughs> there we go. I'm just throwing up so I can keep track of it. Second level, yeah. oh shit. <laughs> Don't miss, bro. Damn. <laughs> Fucking chorus, man. Bro, uh, just fuck it. I don't know how many times I could roll like shit tonight and I just want to die. <laughs> Look, flame was... sagas and soulless for like stealing right. everyone's good luck for right. like, the next three months. <laughs> the, your yeah, great sword, unfortunately, will not catch Mr. Adojo as he steps to the side. My death is not going to be so easy, ruffian. Oh my god, he's so proper. Kill so... the nerd. What? He will adjust his tie. Oh shit, styling on him. Oh no. Uh, you know, I'll give you one thing, at least you dressed nice, but at least you're already wearing your funeral suit. It's your turn's over, baby boy. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh. <laughs> you call me a bitch boy. I heard him. <laughs> Fuck, that's it, my turn. <laughs> Ends turn. Do we leave him to it, Captain? Yes, let's focus on what wave we have coming up towards us. That's so funny. Very good, Captain. <laughs> I mean, you, you're, you're gonna die. Is it? Your turn's over. Fuck, he knows. <laughs> That's he so knows. funny. He knows. Whoa. All right. They're walking together, so they're just gonna move. Go ahead. I will like to prep a spell to go off in case I see... Uh, I would like... For them when they're reaching... No, actually, I'm not gonna do anything because they will... I will basically just be skipping... Actually, I would like to take a martial check. On... Uh... 
the guy in front. If uh, that is a possibility. Yeah. You can marshal check anyone you can see. I would like to marshal check uh, Quill. Quill? Quill. Quiet Quill. Wait, I misspelled uh, that. See. Hold on. <clears throat> Pay no attention to the man behind the curtain. Mm-hmm. He's manning, he's curtaining. Sorry. There you go. Dead. All right, with your martial check, which I'm waiting for you to roll. Uh, that is... There it is. What would you like to know? HP, AC, or equipment? Can I, ch uh, can I see if he has any class? Negative. Damn it. You're not a martial uh... character. He hmm. has no class. Fair enough. Uh, I would like to see his stats then. His attributes are 16 strength in which he is proficient, 14 strength, excuse me, 14 dex in which he is proficient, constitution of 14, 10 intelligence, 16 wisdom in which he is proficient, and 10 charisma. Hmm. Guys, still doing pretty good. Yeah. And that's the end of my turn because I can't really see I can use anything or do anything. Mythos. Hmm. Alright. Uh, I would like to Arcana check the lady. Which one? Uh, the one holding the scroll thing in there, her picture. Amelia. Okay. Amelia, yeah. Meeting. What would you like to know? Uh, I would like to Arcana again as my action because okay. they're far away. Fuck! Oh, Shut up, nerd! <laughs> <laughs> it's still too dark. I can't. They're what? So far. Are those scrolls? <laughs> All right. Well, shit. Well, Captain said to leave him to it. I would rather find them a bit closer, so just marshal checking. Or no, I can't marshal check. I'm just going to ready and sh ready to charge attack someone within my range. Mm -hmm. You got it. Pass. <laughs> he will slowly walk up. <laughs> Prepare yourself, ruffian, for it is my turn. He will stand with a proper, most elegant stance, and once again, adjust his tie. We shall test Let your go. barbarous power versus a true gentleman's weapon. Just shut up and fight me, please. What are you As you wish, he will then throw sand in your face from his pocket. Pocket sanded. <laughs> Pocket sanded by ass. You okay. son of a bitch. Well, that will represent his disengage action. And then he will move here. And then out here. And then he will look around and see them and dash. Bye! <laughs> you dick! <laughs> Motherfucker's a rogue. <laughs> What the fuck is wrong? Where did he go? What did? What the? Oh, Ariel. Man. You know what? <laughs> I'm going to fucking burn down his house anyway. I'm, so gonna, this guy. I'm gonna burn his house down. <laughs> we loot and pillage before we burn. That was so funny, dude. It's like, now you'll face my might. Throw sand and face runs away. <laughs> you sand, son of a fucking sand. sand. <laughs> Man, <laughs> Sorry, go, 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 go. I'll shut up. Oh, man. What would you like to do, Miss Ward? I would like to turn on the lamp at my hip and take out my club. 
If I can, all in one turn. Alright, so that's... Uh, item interaction, pull out the Scion of Matheria. I just would like to turn it on. And, and attach then... it to your hip? Well, it's been attached. Oh, yeah, I'm, yeah, yeah, cool. yeah, I'm turning it on. it on. I'm turning it on. And then yes. equip equip the club and you already got uh yeah you got your tower which, which well yeah yeah you'd have the wait which oh wait it's 40 yeah. feet hold on i adjust this ah! yeah uh the goddess is light you wanted your great club equipped yes okay yes please all right, so cutting, cutting off the the kindness. So just just temperance, and you have passion equipped. All right, cool, cool, cool. Yeah, I believe I only have the one shield. Uh, you you have a sec. You have the uh, the the uh, the monstrous bulwark. <laughs> That's the scary shield. Our objective is to murder them, not give them the chance to flee. Well, it's only it's only frightened for a round. But yeah, but uh, where do you want to go? I suppose. I make, I'm sorry. I'm my adorable self was trying to scroll <laughs> on my phone. I'm watching the Twitch stream. I'm so sorry. I'm trying to get more into view so that way they approach me. Alright, so you want to move out here? Yes. Alright, so five to there. And Yeah, that that area is gonna be fine. I need them to come to me essentially. Alright, and go to there. Mm-hmm. That was an action to activate the the thing, correct, Arcadum? Yeah. Alright. Okay. Cool, cool. Just making sure so she could just see if she could take your, out the dog. Oh your Omega there. Lantern. Mm -hmm. Yep. All right, that done for you. Um, let's see here. You don't need a martial check though. Yes, that's what I was worried. I was gonna forget. Yes, martial check, please. All right. So martial check. If I could, I would like it in the person directly in front of me. I can't tell if that's the Nur or someone else. Uh, you have Mister Adojo, <clears throat> and you then have, have Mister Adojo. You have Quiet Quill. You have Elder Brian, Even Silla, Arcanist Kyle, Thomas Waterwheel, or Amelia Tohen. Which one of these was armored? The arm most heavily armored one is Even Sila. Okay, I would like hers, please. Okay, what would you like to know? Um, A HP, like... AC, equipment, or special abilities? Uh, special abilities, please. She has Action Surge, Fighting Spirit, and this. It keeps going! Mm-hmm. Uh... Weapon specialization, uh, extra attack, equipment mastery, equipment trick, uh, martial and mundane feats, exotic weapon training. Which would you like to know? Exotic weapon training sounds pretty interesting. Any other suggestions? I I I would say grab one of the feats, if anything, but. All right, then let's do a uh, martial feat. <laughs> Her martial feat is... Oh, that's not right. There it is. Um, it is combat adept. <sighs> Got an advanced fighting style. All right. Uh, 
Does that also reveal the advanced fighting style? Or do I have to try to do something else for that? No, I can tell you its name, but not exactly what it does. Yeah. Hold on. Okay. I'm looking for it. I don't think I have it on here. This is weird. Uh, hold on. Give me a second. Hmm. Hold on, give me a second. Got gotcha. you. You good? I'm going nowhere. You got me for three hours, Arcadum. Three hours of pain. I got you for three minutes. Uh oh, deadlock hammer. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay. Alrighty. Um, to finish up my turn, I'll say uh, Thorn Grace to me, and I'll be done with that. Understood, right. Captain. Moving up. Gideon. Uh, a single tear will shed from Gideon's face because he was not called to join Ariel. Um... <laughs> I can't see where the fuck you are. I'm sorry. I have limited span. Fabry hates me. <laughs> <laughs> Keep the others alive. I walk away, abandoning the group. Start burning the other. Join us. Oh. Uh... Gonna marshal check. Uh... For a Marshall check, Elder Brian. Elder Brian, what would you like to know about Elder Brian? Uh, what is his special abilities? They are Og Canal, Primal Infusion, Lesser Primal Apotheosis. Out of character, immediately feels bad. In character, oh, target. What is his uh, lesser apotheosis? Uh, it is lesser primal apotheosis. Um, it does the following uh, during apotheosis. Um, he deals his exposure of extra damage of an element of his choice to all damage sources he controls, and he also gains a plus four to strength, dexterity, and constitution during this time. Cool. All right. Uh... Alright, so I will. Come up to here. And I'm going to uh, item interaction, put away my sword. Second item interaction, pull out my crossbow. That away, equipped my crossbow, and I'm going to target Elder Brian. Thirteen. That will miss. Right. And that's all for me. Moving to here. Moving up to here. Casting a fucking spell. Mage. Those of you with Arcana may want to check that out. We can roll Arcana in response. Oh. <laughs> Alright, man. I, I need to get you guys out of the session. I, you, you're like cursed, man. I need to get you guys the fuck out of here. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Uh, does... What is wrong? Can Ariel, even though she's not Arcana trained, but she's a paladin? No. Okay. No, sadly. Alright, no. All right. All right, and... Uh... 
at the end of that round, start of the next round, that's a good place to call it right there. Mikaya, you'll All start right. us off at the start of the round. Yeah. Let's see if we got We're gonna fucking or... curse this game, man. Fuck. Yeah, yeah it right. is. <laughs> fucking our rolls were shit the whole fucking second. I know. Yeah, let's get you guys, let's get you guys out of here. It's like, holy yeah. fuck. Help. Pain was like, real. Like, I have a birthday 20, but I'm too horrified to use it this entire session. Be like, nah, bro, nah. It's not gonna help. Man, you could have given it to me while I was about to crush this guy with a level 2. My fuck! I mean, you no, guys, man. You guys no. have done. You guys have, I mean, you guys have done a good job so far. Everything, so. Everything's dying. No, let's let's save it for when we're crushing that poor dying. We're not able to kill him. Because if I that fuck, because if I credit that guy well in the fucking smite, he got possibly could have just fucking killed him right there. Lolly. Ah, uh, here we go. Oh, yeah. There we go. The, the finished version for of completed Ooh! animation. Yeah, oh, that looks so good. Me. So good. Bro, it's Much great job, Casey. fantastic. Great job. Amazing. Mm -hmm. I love the little D20. So good. Mm -hmm. Investigations are involved with many tasks. Searching, finding evidence, asking for information. And then this shit. <laughs> Those guys are wired differently. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm trying to make Mikael just a fucking just uh, oh how is this shit with the church. Oh, bro, that's fantastic. Oh, thank you, Casey. Oh, 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 oh. wait. Why do I have a feeling that? Killing. That is beautiful. That's good mm -hmm. stuff, man. Remember yeah. the fucking mission. And then <laughs> pocket set. <laughs> Yes. Son of a <laughs> What a fight. Get that man a shot. Now it's time for a real fight, sir. Throw sand in face, <laughs> runs away. Throw sand in face. <laughs> you do. Uh, that man knew better than to square the fuck up. Who are you, your executioner? Oh, oh. Ah, okay. Right, one more. Oh, we got, we got another one. <laughs> I gotta give kudos to KC because I'm a. <laughs> oh man. Hello? <laughs> yes! Yes! Oh, God. yes! Oh my god, I love that. I rushed Very Mr. good. Nipples, is that you? Oh, man. Swing. <laughs> Well done, guys. You know what? I love the halo effect. Thank you. You guys have done yeah, a great job. You, you yeah, successfully you. Uh, I, I just killed an old woman would... and captured the local yeah. hunter. Good job, yeah. guys. I, I yeah. want to give KC kudos because I didn't realize I made the COD reference until later. And the fact that I were like, I could pass up this opportunity to draw a COD reference. And I'm like, oh, God, I did. I really did. <laughs> Thank you, guys. Thanks for playing, everybody. I had a great time. Um, thanks Thank chat you, for Arcade. watching. Thanks for all of the um, all the good follows and subs today. You guys are great. Thank you so much. And I will see you guys next time. Bye. Bye, Dragon Ball Z. Bye, -bye.